Hello, hello everybody, hello Blossom, hello Denny, and hello SK. I'm late getting on with my mic because I've been too busy talking with you guys in chat. How is everyone doing today? Happy Saturday, happy weekend, happy wherever, whatever day of the week it is for you. I hope you all had a, have had a lovely last couple days. It's been hard for me to get into the swing of a Saturday stream because yesterday I thought it was Saturday all day. Because I wasn't streaming. Now I'm thinking today's Sunday, but it's Saturday, so I'm trying to think it's not Friday now. That's confusing. But that's kind of how it feels for me right now. <laughs> Killers make you want a DC? I am, like, now scared to get in the fog. Y'all talking about how spicy it is. It has been so spicy the last two times I've played on live servers that I'm, like, anxious to get on nowadays. The last two times we've played on the server, the live server, it's been super spicy. I want the Black Raven for Halloween, but it didn't give it to me. Oh, no, until a few minutes ago. That sucks that it wasn't in time for Halloween. I haven't got the Ravens yet, but y'all know I'm a little, not behind, but I'm, just, I'm not at that point yet. And after it had that, um, that, um, sorry, my cat was in my lap, so I'm trying to get now get in position for stream. Hello, safe. How's it going? How are you doing? Sorry, I'm like I have like 500 things we're talking about in chat. <laughs> but um, what was I saying? Oh, but after we had that internet or that loading issue in Disney Dreamlight, I haven't got on since. So I need to get on and just like do my stuff and get some friendships up. I still have the the little like wind up fox from the Halloween event. I didn't mean to be that way. I'm just meant as hey, you know, some days, some days you just gotta give the spice back. You know what I mean? We, yeah, we totally haven't been chatting in DM either. No, no, we haven't been doing that either. <laughs> Sorry, I'm catching up on chat. <laughs> I was like trying to talk and then all of a sudden lots of things are going on. Blossom, thank you so much for the shout outs for everybody. I appreciate it. It happens, I guess. It's not that long till reset either. That's true. It's actually a lot closer to reset than I realize. So I guess people are wanting uh, that eerie one, I guess. But yeah, um... Playing like deep buttholes with bacon lube, but the less lube <laughs> for extra roughness. <laughs> Pretty much right. I'm sending you all the spicy. Let's go. You know, maybe we'll have to play spicy today. Maybe. But as I was saying, like the last two times we've played on live servers, it's been like, like extra spicy for me. And was it, okay, so we see, today's Saturday, so Wednesday we played on the PTV, PTV was like up and down, there was some spiciness even in the PTV, but at the same time, it's okay, it's whatever. Monday was like hard at the beginning of stream, but then as it got better, or as stream went on, it got better, so I'm kind of hoping today is kind of like that, but I normally don't play Dead by Daylight on the weekends either. Or, like, I should say, Survivor on the weekends. Usually if I'm playing on the weekends, I'm playing Killer because I'm offline. So, I know there's always, like, an extra bit of spiciness on the weekends because more people can be playing because they're off work and such. But that's not always the case. I've just heard that. So, we're going to see how spicy it is out there today. I'm hoping for not so much spiciness. But... Denny's right. It is really close to rank reset. I didn't realize. It was already, let's see, today's the 5th, so that means it's a week away, pretty much. It's almost a week. It's week tomorrow, excuse me. Today is the 5th. Yeah, so it's a week, a week till rank reset, so that's kind of understandable, but at the same time, I never really still understand it. Like, why? <laughs> Like, why? I understand wanting to get the eerie one, but personally, I never play that way to get it. I get what I get. If I get there, I get there. If I don't, I don't. I am here just working, too. No worries, Blossom. If you have to be at work, I totally understand. But I appreciate you being here nonetheless and being absolutely amazing. 
Just so you know, but thank you for letting me know. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. Don't let anyone, don't let anyone catch you. Your secret's safe here. Exactly. If it is too spicy, you can play Disney, and that's probably what I will do if it becomes too spicy and I'm not having fun. Because on Monday, it got to the point where I really didn't feel like playing Dead by Daylight after so much time. Like, it was just getting to the point where I'm just sitting there like, this is so annoying, the way everybody is playing on both sides. Like, I didn't want to play Killer because I wasn't having fun. I wasn't really having as much fun in Survivor. But a couple matches turned that around, so I ended up having fun, like, the later half of the stream. But if today doesn't ever get better, we need to hop over to Disney and play on the Disney game because I haven't played it for a while. Well, since last stream. Because it had that loading issue, and one day I tried to log in late, Is that an error or are you happy and I let it sit there while I was watching, I think, like, Magic Stream or something, and I was going to have her on the background and play Disney. It never loaded. I just, I gave up. <laughs> I just gave up. Thank you, Brad, so much for all the shout-outs. How are you doing today? People always wait till the last <sighs> second to get the oh area and then go so far <laughs> last few days to get there. Yeah. Oh, Jesus yeah, Christ. Yeah, they do. My heart I hurts. think what happens a lot of the time <laughs> is people are like, ah, you know what, I'm going to play, I'll get eerie, no problem. And then when they start realizing they ain't getting there, that's when they start going harder because they realize, hey, I'm not getting to that eerie as fast as I wanted to. And thank you, Blossom, for giving a shout out to Brad as well. I was going to say something and I lost my train of thought. We're talking about Disney. I was going to say something to that. Oh, well, I don't know. <laughs> but <laughs> I hope just sitting here in my dino mask. Are you? I saw that on Discord, by the way. That was nice. That was nice. I don't know where everyone is sitting today. I claimed all the seats for myself. That is true. I didn't want to say anything because I thought it was um, kind of funny <laughs> that SK got here first today and we were talking before I pushed the live button and SK was claiming all of the seats. I'm going to leave it up to her to tell you how she claimed all the seats, but you know, I'm just letting you guys know she did claim all the seats. She was here first. She had first pick and she said she wanted them all. But SK, I need three seats for my big money. Same. I need at least two. <laughs> but I got the streamer seat, so my seat is safe from SK. <laughs> my seat's always safe from SK because I'm here first. Well, I think I was here first. I was a little late to stream because it, all of a sudden, it was one o'clock here. I didn't realize it was one o'clock. I was talking to SK on Discord. We were having a great conversation. I didn't look at my messages before I went on. But we we're having this great conversation about Hamilton. Because I watched Hamilton last night for SK so that I could talk to her again. Because I missed her so much. <laughs> she disowned me after I said I'd never watched it. And so I watched it last night for her. And I freaking loved it. I loved it so much that I wanted to watch it again. I promised I would watch it like three or four times for her as well. Well, it was 2 a.m. when I went to bed last night, so I didn't get to watch it again. But I really, really, really want to watch it again. I did really like it a lot. So if you guys like musicals, even if you don't like musical, musicals, give it a shot. I freaking loved it. I wanted to watch it again, but it was 2 a.m. and I needed sleep for stream today, so that is why I didn't watch it again. But I wanted to watch it again. I ran around chat like the all of them. She did. She did. I will vouch for her. I wasn't just going to say it. I was going to let her tell you guys. <laughs> Halloween, Hamilton, and writing, right? Yup. You watched it with her. What did you think, Denny? Did, did you say what you thought? I remember we were talking about it the other day when uh, SK was disowning me for not watching it. But I don't remember if you said if you liked it or not. Oh, Brad being brave. I love it. Daddy and I had a chat in Discord today about flavored lube. Is that why I had the, the DM about cheese lube? 
because I was laughing. It caught me off guard. It's like, oh, yes, okay. I'm like, I cannot imagine why, but I, okay. <laughs> but that explains it now. That explains it. But yeah, so we were talking about Halloween Hamilton and the writing, and then, um, oh, and also, to let Denny know, I also watched more Riverdale. I'm like in the process of watching Riverdale for Denny. I want to watch it anyway because I have watched all seasons except for the pers uh, the current one. I got up to season, or excuse me, episode 11, I think yesterday. No, not yesterday, the day before. And um, it's getting interesting. It was already interesting. I meant to post about this on the Discord and then I got sidetracked by my um, DMs. Uh, <laughs> but um, I was watching Riverdale Thursday and it got to episode 11 and all of the twists and turns, not twists and turns necessarily, but like, I don't want to, I don't want to say spoilers because it, it, I just don't like to spoil it for people if they do want to watch it, but it also has been out for a while, so I don't know. Um, I guess I just won't say too much, but all of the things that are happening, it's like, what the hell? I cannot wait to see, to see if it has more explanation as to why these things are happening. I have like my theories and thoughts of it, but I don't like to say until it either airs or um, I get to that point to see if I'm right or not. Just, just say it though. But I've been watching those two things for SK and Denny. I've watched SKs, but I'm going to watch it again. I really wanted to watch it again. <laughs> yes, no wonder. <laughs> It was decent enough. Musicals ain't all that much of my thing, but it wasn't bad. Understandable. I can totally understand that. Because I was telling SK, I, I like musicals, but it just has to be like the right kind, I guess. All the ones I've ever really seen have been movie-based musicals. So it's like a movie. Like the Moulin Rouge I love, but it's a movie. Um, I didn't like Sweeney Todd, but that's also a movie and everything. But what I really liked about Hamilton is... It wasn't really a movie. It was the musical itself on stage. It wasn't, you know, um, a pr it was a production, but it wasn't like a movie set and all that. You know what I mean? And I freaking loved that about it because I thought it was going to be a movie. Kind of like all the other ones, you know, paid actors. Because I know the guy who plays Am Hamilton is a very renowned person and everything. So I thought it was going to be like a movie. And then when it came on, I was like, oh, it's actually, like, the musical. Like, the actual stage production. And I thought that was really cool. And everything. I wish, like, there, oh, well, there might be more. But I kind of, after watching that, wanted to watch more surrounding musicals. And like I said, it has to be, like, the right kind for me to enjoy. But at the same time, I'm open to giving more a chance. But I also agree. It isn't for everybody. It is, it's very, um... Well, it's like anything. It's very specific. Everybody has their own tastes in what they like and stuff, so I get it. Wait a minute, cheese is my life. Let's not ruin it. I mean, that's not ruining it. <laughs> it's not ruining it, no. <laughs> Another streamer I was watching before you had their stream tag with no cheese lube. Oh my gosh, okay. May I ask why that they have their stream tagged as no cheese loop? I know, I feel like it's so disconnected from the main show, right? That's why I'm trying to figure out, like, what the hell is going on? It seems like it's not its own show, but disconnected is a good way to say it. So I have, like, my theories from what happened in the first six that I watched to where it's at now... But as I said, I'm not going to say what I think because I kind of want to see if it plays out the way I'm thinking and then also if I'm right. Usually when I have theories about TV shows, movies, or whatever the case is, I don't like to say it because I like my brain to try and process, you know, what's going on. And that I'm only, what I say, 11 episodes in, I still got quite a ways to go. So there's probably a lot of other things that will answer questions in my head. Or will play out maybe the way I think, or totally change my thought process behind it. You know what I mean? I got a while to go. I'll probably watch more of it either tonight or tomorrow, or I'll watch Hamilton again. Who knows? <laughs> I was a big fan of West Side Story. However, I got into that from watching Glee. 
I know about West Side Story, but I've never seen anything from it. But that is also one I've always wanted to watch. But I've never actually watched. Um, I, like I said, I know it, but I've never watched anything from it. See, I never watched Glee either. But I would like to go back and watch it. It was one of those ones where when it was on, I think I was too busy watching other things or on to different shows or whatever at the time and it kind of just went by the wayside for me and now i need to go back and watch it now with streaming services and everything i need to um like start catching up on a lot of things yeah he did moana and encanto too i didn't realize after i watched hamilton last night i looked him up because i know about him i know he did some of the moana and then after I looked him up on YouTube, or not YouTube, uh, Googled him last night, because I know who he is, and I know all about him, and I know everything, um, or not everything, but a lot of the things he's done. But I didn't realize, like, how much he was involved in both of those. I thought he just did, like, you know, some music for it, and that's it. I didn't realize how much he did, though. Encanto is one I still need to watch. I've seen Moana, but Mo Encanto is one of those ones where I haven't got around to yet either. It's another thing. Things have started coming out, and I've gotten so behind on watching a lot of things. So I need to start really sitting down and catching up. Because what I do is I sit down, and then I watch Twitch, and then all of a sudden, it's too late to watch anything. Either I'll fall asleep during the movie show or whatever. So I need to start like sitting down and watching things. But also Christmas is coming up, and I'm going to have to sit down and watch all my favorite Christmas movies, so things are going to start getting behind. Because, <laughs> oh, Christmas Story 2 comes out, like, in a couple weeks. I want to see that so bad, because I love the original movie. The preview is so amazing looking. And then also that new Santa Claus TV show comes out on Disney Plus that I want to watch. It was referencing a game she had played not long ago where they said the nacho cheese can be oh where the nacho cheese said that could be the nacho cheese can be used for lube. Ah, oh, okay. Oh my gosh, string cheese from the base to the tip. <laughs> Just whirling around. Oh my gosh, you guys. Hi Magic, how are you? I'm a little behind on my chat, so I'm going back and reading because I was talking about stuff. I know! See, that also! Me and SK were talking about the Halloween movies. We both need to rewatch Halloween's 1, 2, and ends now as well. So I gotta go back and watch those. After what SK told me in my DMs this morning, I need to go back and watch that. And now I gotta watch, like, new all these movies that are coming out. Christmas is coming out! <laughs> so it's, like, all my Christmas movies I'm gonna be distracted with, and I'm gonna get even farther behind on things. So between now and like Thanksgiving Day, <laughs> I'm gonna try and like fit in like a movie or a TV show a day to catch up, for sure. And then Christmas will come around and I'll forget about everything. You watched Encanto like three or four times this year, and you love Encanto. I've wanted to watch it. Just typical me, haven't got around to it yet. Yeah. But I will not stop talking to you over not watching it. Thank you. I just got you back, SK. I don't want to lose you again. <laughs> I don't want to lose you again. There's already a Christmas story, too. Yeah, I posted it in the Discord. No, it's not two. It's technically the remake. I, no, it's not even the remake. I guess they're just forgetting that two existed. And they're just calling this one two. <laughs> Why are we talking about nacho cheese lube? Because SK was talking about it. <laughs> That's why. <laughs> SK was talking to me in my DMs this morning about it. Thank you, Brad, so much for giving Magic a shout out. I'm pretty shitty. I'm sorry. But I'll be okay. I saw on your Discord this morning you weren't feeling well. I hope everything's getting better for you, um, Magic. I hope everything's starting to feel better. I saw you weren't going to be live today because of it, though. So, I'm so sorry. You need to add this to your watch list? Okay, let me click this. Oh, I saw something about this. When was it? Is this out? Only in theaters. Okay, there it is. Only in theaters, December 2nd.
When a team, I'm not gonna watch it at the second. I'm reading it. When a team of mercenaries breaks into a wealthy family compound on Christmas Eve, taking everyone inside hostage, the team is unprepared for a surprise combatant. Santa, oh, Santa Claus is. Wait, Santa Claus is Hopper? Okay, I'll watch it just for that. Actually, there's some good uh, actors in it too. I was reading it. Hmm. The funny thing is, I saw something about this. I didn't realize Santa Claus was Hopper, though. <laughs> that that'll make me watch it just for that. Just say it. See, you added things to my list, <laughs> but that's Christmas. E. It has Santa Claus in it, so I can watch that during the Christmas season. Because every Christmas season, I start watching like my favorites. Or, not, not necessarily my favorites. My favorites are all, like, watched four or five times during the Christmas season. But I always have, like, this list of movies that I have to watch because I don't watch Christmas movies any other time of the year. It's, like, a sin to me. So I, like, reserve all Christmas movies from, like, maybe the week of th Thanksgiving, depends on how busy I am, through maybe New Year's Day if I forget to watch a few. So, anything else usually gets put on the back burner, because I love my Christmas movies and everything. Oh, okay, I ate something that made my tummy bad. Ooh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I thought it was something going to be something else, like, with your surgery. Like, something, like, happened from that. So, I'm glad it was, like, I, like not something extremely, extremely, extremely bad. Because I saw one of my friends recently... Uh, was talking about her daughter went in for a surgery like last week and it was nothing nothing like your surgery it's so, totally different but her daughter had to go back for an emergency surgery like a week later because something happened so after i saw that on her facebook this morning and then you said that i was like oh no oh no did something happen that with her your surgery or something so that's where my mind went first yeah, that is what caught my attention at first, but it looks really good. I think I saw a poster or something, like, on Twitter. And I was like, oh, okay, cool. And then I didn't realize it was him. Now that I see that it's him, I'm going to watch it. Or I'm going to watch the preview. I'm sure it looks probably good, though. Oh, but it is from your surgery? Oh, okay. I thought maybe you were saying you just had, like, a stomach ache. Foods are not fun with... Oh, are not fun with this right now. I'm sorry. I don't like hearing that. No. Well, I hope you start feeling better, Magic. I hope whatever it is passes or you can get comfortable or get rid of it or whatever you can do. I hope it's soon. I don't like hearing that you're in pain and struggling. Not at all. I'm trying to put you on my phone so you can, so, so you can go make dinner. Excuse me. So you... Flat. Time to put you on my phone so can fix go fix dinner. I totally screwed that up because there was no pro down in there. <laughs> I was trying to say so you can go fix dinner. Okay, SK, I will be on your phone. Hi from your phone if I'm already there. Enjoy making dinner. What are we having tonight? Anything good? I know it's gonna be good, but what are we having tonight? So speaking of food, let me put, click this. What am I having for dinner? Or snack? Grilled cheese sandwich with piece of garlic cheese bread. Let's go. Yes, please. Yes. Please and thank you. Time to put you on my PC so you can go make us dinner. Okay, I'll go make you guys dinner. <laughs> I don't know why when I was reading SK's thing right there that I kept trying to put you in there. I was trying to say, time to put you on my phone so you can go fix dinner. And I was like, wait, no, I'm not fixing dinner yet. Actually, I don't have to make dinner tonight either. I asked my mom before I got on, I said, do you need help with dinner tonight? She's like, nah, I got it. You stream. I said, okay, mom. <laughs> I go stream. Pork chops, num. We're having pork, cho pork chops sometime this week. Not tonight, though. We bought pork chops the other day. I don't know what kind, but we are having pork chops sometime this week. All right, let's hop over to here. Let's get our day started. So, whoopsie. There we go. We're going to do, let me click here. Let me, oh, I already got it. We're going to do our normal roller. So, we're going to get back into the groove here. We're going to roll for our survivor, see who we're going to play for the day, uh, and go with the flow. If it's too spicy, we're hopping over to Disney if we can. If we can't get over to Disney, we're doing something else. So, we'll see 
what goes on for the day. We can drink now, lol. Let's go! We can drink now! <laughs> Brad, thank you so much for the freaking 21 months! Time to party! What do you, okay, what do you bring in? What's your drink? I don't drink much, but I'll find something that sounds good and I can drink. <laughs> thank you, Brad, so much for the 21 months! Holy hell! It's been 21 months? I will say this over and over and over again. Time freaking flies! And I swear it does not feel like it's been that long already. When I think back to when I first came back to Twitch... That was almost two years ago. And then this year, I came back... Well, it wasn't even back. I was off for like, what, a month? Two months? I came back again? And that was already a year ago. I have streamed for a year straight. With no long extended breaks this time. Yeah, I've taken like a break here and there like on a Friday. Took like the weekend off. Little tiny ones, but... It's been a year since I debuted as a VTuber. I couldn't believe that. I love coffee, so Bailey's Irish Cream? I'll go with that. That sounds really good. I'll definitely go with that. I'll bring some kind of schnapps, because I really like schnapps. I don't care what flavor. Well, I do care what flavor. It's gotta be a good flavor, but I can totally bring that. Did they fix the loading issue? Okay, okay. I haven't logged in since it had that issue. So I wasn't sure if it was fixed yet, and I hadn't seen anything about it. So I was kind of assuming it was, and I was gonna get on yesterday, and then my brain went to a totally different place and did other things, so I didn't actually get on. Dino Nuggies with a piece of toast! Let's go! That sounds good. Toast is a little plain with dino nuggies, but I'd still eat it. It would be much better than something else you could have gotten. I know! I know! I'm such a bad friend. <laughs> but I came back! I came back, I could have been like, that's screw you I'm God. <laughs> but as I was saying, time just flies. I was going to have a celebration for my one-year VTuber anniversary, whatever, and I never did because all of a sudden, boom, it was here. And I was like, damn it, I was trying to plan something, and then all of a sudden, it, the date was here and I didn't get around to it, which is me, but I also lose inspiration sometimes when planning things. Oh, SK, caviar with a big soft pretzel, because it was the caviar, Brad. <laughs> but do the same. I don't want that yet. Big soft pretzel sounds good, though. Mmm! An order of veggie burgers with a hot- with a cup of hot chocolate? It's an interesting combination, but I'd go for it. <laughs> Let me get rid of this one. Hey! Successfully opened a, Kate, a gate as Kate, so we're gonna do that. First, we're gonna go look at something in the store. See if I could use both hands. Oh no, Teddy got an error! Teddy always gets the error! Oh god. Thank you, Magic, so much for the shout outs! <laughs> Did you say Boobit was here? Did I say that? Kick it. You never Kick know. It. It's out of my mouth. Kick it. I swear though, every time. Later, bitch! Every time, Teddy <gasps> always gets an error. <sighs> Oh my god! Oh, <laughs> oh, oh Jesus Christ! Oh, ask my heart hurts. the chair for magic to sit on. That's so nice of you. Oh, I lived for both of you. Did you buy both of them? We were gonna go check them out real quick because I forgot that they came out since I've streamed. There we go. No, then Teddy's getting caviar. Apparently, caviar's the food today. Bot always likes to choose one thing. Apparently it's caviar with a cherry on top. I like how the bot's like, here, Denny, have some caviar. It's okay, it's got a cherry on top. It makes it all better. It always makes it all better if you put a cherry on top, right? No. <laughs> Ma it's true, very true. It's magic is still recovering, so she needs a chair. That is very true. So that's very kind of USK. I don't know if Magic was here when we were talking about what you did to the chairs, but she does need one. I agree. 
You only got the sure one and the killer still don't love me despite being so cute? No. Killers are supposed to respect the cuteness. Because look at this. Look at this. Look how adorable this is. I won't be buying it just to the fact that I don't have the money to buy it. But this is definitely, probably... Well, I do like the Lisa and the Sybil. But, oh well, I like James too. But I think this is the cutest one they've got for her. I like it. So, this came out... Thursday? I think it was Thursday, because Wednesday was PTV, which was, yeah, Thursday. Excuse me, so it's been out a couple days, and I like it. I think it's freaking adorable. I know people are, who are not fang lovers, are bitching and complaining that she got another one, but I am not sad about it, because it looks so cute. <laughs> Look at this. So, her whole thing is she's a gamer, she cosplays, so on and so forth, you know, in that kind of realm. I think it's absolutely adorable that they gave her a cosplay of this and made it look like she was cosplaying it. Like, it doesn't look identical like this one, okay? This was a Jill cosplay, but it looks like, almost identical to Jill's. I mean, I could probably go over to Jill's, look at it more closely and see the difference and stuff, but... The Jill cosplay one is just too close to it, looks identical, and honestly, when she's in the fog, I think she's Jill sometimes. I will. Like, I won't even realize it's Fang until, I don't know, at some point it dawns on me. But this one looks like a cosplay! It looks cute! Like, you can see the, like, areas, like, looks like that she made! And I'm really glad they didn't give her something that looks almost identical to Cheryl's. I played a match shortly after they came out and played a match and got jumped right away and tunneled out. Well, they just thought you were way too cute. They couldn't compete with you. So they're like, oh, the Cheryl, she's too cute, got to get rid of her. And no, that's not the reason, probably just crappy players, but that still sucks. I still think like, I don't know, I shouldn't think, say think. I don't know why people do that. I don't care the reason. I don't get why people think that's a fun way to play. But I do like hers as well. Will hers ever... Probably not, huh? I was just going to ask, will hers ever go to shards? But being that it's from technically the Silent Hill... Collection? I was going to say series. Collection, it probably will always be... Um, cells but i like it i like it i think it's cute i think it looks really good that it does look like she made it herself or put it together herself or you know whatever you want to do i think the ears i think those are so adorable i like cheryl's but i think i like hers better because they just look cuter <laughs> but cheryl's is also from the series where fangs is a cosplay of it so there is that. If you guys want the new Silent Hill collection, it is just two costumes or outfits or whatever you want to classify them as. Um, so it's Cheryl's and then it's Fang's cosplay of it. So if you guys want that, that currently came out and is out and all that good stuff. So let me go grab my spinner. I think I have it up somewhere. Oh, yeah, it's right here. Where here it is. All right, it's been a while since we've done the spinner for our survivor because we've been playing either Michaela or Kate because uh, Halloween and they had costumes and those are the only two costumes I had. And then on Wednesday, oh, we played. We played with the new chapter, which uh, will be out on November twenty second. And I love that. I posted, if you guys are not part of my Discord, let me go over here and post this real quick for you guys. If you guys are not part of my Discord, and if you uh, want me, here's the link. But I posted something in the Dead by Daylight section. If you like the new Survivor. It's not a real thing, but this is something I really wish they would put in the game. For our new Survivor coming. And if you haven't seen it, go look and enjoy. <laughs> just saying, just saying. But I posted that right before I went live, because I went over to my Twitter to get ready to post my Twitter post for today that I was going live, and that was on the top of my feed. 
Yum. That's all I'm gonna say. Yum. Let's spin and see who we're gonna play today. What? No! Cheryl? Wait, didn't we just play Cheryl? We played Cheryl like a couple days ago. Okay, you know what I'm gonna do? I will play Cheryl. But I'm going to respin after a couple matches because I think we just played her. I think I might do that from now on. If we roll someone we just played, we'll play him for a couple matches so that we can just play with play with them in general. And then we will respin after a couple to see if we can get somebody we haven't seen in a while, which there's quite a few characters, but there's also some we have seen. So we will play Cheryl for a little bit. And then we will switch it up and play someone else that we haven't seen. Let me hop over to the screen for now. Oops! Hello, Holly! Thank you so much for the lurk! I didn't see the shout-out clip going, and I already pushed it over here, but that's okay. I don't think I missed too much. Thank you, Brad, so much for giving Holly a shout-out. <laughs> sound is on for you guys? Yes, yeah, sound is on for you guys. Okay, so... Let's play, where is she, Cheryl? Let's play Cheryl for a few matches. See, I'm only at gold four. Well, I got one pip to go to gold three. Um, I might try and play killer today, but I'm gonna wait and see how it feels. Cause the last few times I've played killer, I just haven't really been in the mood to play killer. And that's not really well how, how I'm feeling today, is killer style, if you know what I mean. What was I doing last time? Shadow step, circle of healing, head on, quick and quiet, okay. Oh, let's go over to the archive real quick. I wanna see... Three days. Okay, so the new level opens next Wednesday. So we only have... We only have killer ones except for one, I think. Ghost face, killer, 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 killer. Yep, we have this last challenge. Drop a pallet to stun the killer two times. Complete this in a single trial. <sighs> that can be difficult. I hope I come across a killer that has, like, spirit fury who wants to be hit with a pallet. But other than that, um, yeah. Not, not something I love to do. Um... I sent you a pick back to reply to your Twitter post. <laughs> oh, in Discord. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> I will see that after stream. I was like, wait, what? So I'm going to go with my normal build because uh, why not? It's not Halloween anymore. So let's take off our Halloween charm. I'm trying to think, what are some of the new ones we've got recently? Let's put the little cafe cup and we'll keep the puffers one on as well. Um, so I'm just dropping pallets. I don't think I'll do a pallet build. I think I'll just do my normal, which is head on, lucky break, quick and quiet. Um, because I like that combination. But on Wednesday, we tried playing with head on and tried stunning the killer with it, with the new perk that's coming out for it. Nothing really changed. Honestly, all the killers who were running it did not even... I only have resilience level one. All the killers who were running it actually really didn't uh, capitalize on it. But, um... Let's just put this in. Um, I think it might become a perk for killers that a lot of killers won't really use it because... They'll just get tired of it, I guess, would be a way to say it. Well, let's just go with this. Because that happens. Like, we we were talking about this the other day. How, um... Perks will come out with new chapters. Um, when either survivor, killer side, whatever. And people will... I don't want to say complain all the time about it. But they will complain about them. Oh, that person has the full Yui outfit. I don't have it yet. Because, um, example was a lot of people were talking about the Hattie perk that came out with the flashlights. And I never seen anyone using that. I think that people might use, was it Hubris? 
Was that what it was? The head on stun one? I think killers will use it a little bit, but I don't know if it'll become one of those perks that it'll be worked into people's builds. So, and what I'm trying to say is I'm not gonna, like, be afraid to run my head on combination. Because I want to see if I can work it to get away from killers who are using it, because it's only a 20 second cooldown. But on the PTB, every time I stunned someone and got exposed, none of the killers actually went after me. I head on stunned them, tried to run away to use the 20 seconds up, and they didn't even commit to a chase. So I don't know if I can do it. But it also depends on the map. So. I won't be changing my build until it becomes an issue where I'm always being tunneled out or something for using it, but for now, until that happens, which is the 22nd, we will be just running with our normal build. Because I really liked a couple of um, Vita Rio's perks, especially, I've already forgot the name of it, Potential Energy? That one was really cool, but I also feel like it's one where... You kind of need to be working on a gen with possibly somebody else to really get good value out of it. Midwitch! I mean, works, I'm Cheryl, but... Alright, good luck, Fang. Alright, first of the match of the day. It don't count. I haven't played... Oh, not a legion. I'm trying to get away from here because... I don't want to be with somebody... ...against a legion. I'm going downstairs. All right, but again, first match today doesn't count. It's been since last Monday I played, I guess you could say competitively? Because on the PTV I will play, not necessarily my normal way of playing, but kind of practicing, testing things out here and there. But also really not giving a crap if I die and such, so. Today, I will put in more of an effort to not die or save my team. And also, while we're sitting here repairing our gen, on Saturdays, I will be playing DVD from now on, or I think I'll probably keep my Saturday streams as um, my normal day of stream. Monday will be our variety day, so we'll be playing, um, I think... The Resident Evil Village DLC that came out a couple of weeks ago, or like a week ago. So we'll be playing that on Monday. And then Wednesday will be DVD, and then next Saturday will be DVD as well. But I do like so far streaming on Saturday. It's just kind of messing with my brain right now because I don't feel like it's Saturday. I don't know what it feels like it is. But not Saturday. Right, I did that gen all by myself and never heard him once. Well, I heard his sick beats in the distance. What the? Okay, he's picking her up. Well, because he was trying to crawl away and not heal. You need to go after her, but... What? Is he gonna try and get her him to basement? Does he have that killer challenge that's like... 
Okay, I'm gonna wait and see. Oh, he got off. Okay. Does he have that killer challenge? Just like get everybody to basement. No, you go away! <laughs> I got this. Sorry, Fang. It took so long. Tunneling her. Flat out tunneling the fag. I tried to take the hit, but he didn't even hit me. right below me. Uh, Wednesday will be DB so we can collect, call, wait, what? We call Water Hose Wednesday where we have to, oh, where we have to keep me chilled. Yes. Yes. I was trying to think, speaking of calling something that, I feel bad for that Fang. He went right after her. It wouldn't have mattered if I tried to heal her in the basement. He was coming right back after he saw her get off hook. But anyways, I have Variety Friday, which has like a nice ring to it. It just kind of rhymes. I was trying to think of a new name for Mondays. So far I have it as Mix It Up Mondays, but I don't know if that really works. Okay, someone's in the area. I'm going to see if I can get this gen done. I think he's below me, so... Well, if this is a telltale sign of how the day is going to go. So far, he's tunneling out the fang. Luckily, she got free. See if I can, I don't know if I can get him off the hook now. Cause he's now on a camp in the area. Monday mashup? Well, that's a good one too. Oh, we got Iron Maiden. Well, it doesn't matter, I'm already injured. Oh, this has got to be a new lead. Go for it. Go for it, Fang. Go for it. No, go for it, Fang. Oh my gosh! He just, like, totally bypasses me. Every time! Stop! Oh my gosh! He has such a blinders on! I'm sitting here injured in front of him! And he won't hit me! I guess I'm going up here. He will not hit me at all. I don't know where another gen is. I know there was one downstairs almost done. Monday Mayhem? Oh, that's another good one. Dang, now we're gonna have to put like a pole or something up. Oh, there's one. Um... Trying to find someone to heal me so that we can get maybe some... Gen done? Or the last gen done? But I freaking don't know where everybody is! <gasps> There's everybody in here. Let me run down here. I think they're going for the save. 
Did he smash the boom? to do. Fang is the one healed. Yeah, if she can heal me, I can totally try and get them. But our first match of the day, we're playing against pretty much somebody who's... <clears throat> wow! Y'all see that? I'm gonna just follow him and body block him. No, stop. Holy hell! I literally stood in front of him and he had to go around me. Girl, I will take the hit for you as long as I can. He literally walks around me though. I even pushed him into a corner for him to not go after the fang. And he just like would not hit commit to hitting me. I could probably sit on a gen for the whole time and he won't hit me. Let's see if he comes for it. Nope. Nope. There he goes. Oh, you hit me! Finally! I was feeling kind of like... Oh, but he left. Okay. Thanks for giving me my speed boost, though. It's resilience. I'm being an absolute asshole to this person. <laughs> Oops, sorry, Fang! Oh my gosh, I didn't see you there. I'm so sorry. I'm done, sorry. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Seth. Like. Oh, we got this. Yeah, I know. We got this. Oh, love your bot! Why, thank you! God, fake! He's coming! <laughs> I tried again and he still doesn't want me holy hell oh i told Minnie about your stream well welcome on in again oh, i didn't say it thank you so much for the follow welcome on in i'm sorry i'm very distracted i'm watching this legion basically like ignore me like to the fact where there we go finally 
I will body block him and everything, and he just bypasses me. Let's go. I will go down for this team, though. I will go down for this team. They deserve to live. I body blocked him so many times. And he ignored me all match. Now he's mad at me because he sucks. Oops, I don't want to try and escape. Oh, we got this. If she can open the door. We got this. No! I didn't do anything all game. I've started bullying him the later half here. Uh, basically because he was tunneling everybody. I actually started bullying him more toward the end of stream because, or in the stream, end of the match because. He basically tried to tunnel people out of the game. Very focused there. Uh, I know. I uh, know. SK says something about a stripper pole, and I gotta read it. <laughs> Installs the stripper pole in the middle of chat and turns on the music and lights. Let's go. We're having a fun time up in here. But again, Gubs, thank you so much for telling me about my stream and welcome on into both of you. Uh, I literally say it. Nice job, team. Double pip to start the day! Oh, they had to be brand new. Distressing, Iron Maiden, Deerstalker, Discordance. Uh, anyways, um... Where was I? Welcome in. Stripper poles in the middle of chat. Oh, chat. Open bars in the back corner. Seats are... Sit at your own risk since I licked them all before stream. Just to let you guys know. It is true. I, I, I watched her do it. <laughs> She also, oh, Mackenzie May, whenever she arrives. Well, I appreciate you spreading the word about my stream, and thank you. Sounds like he deserved it then. Yeah, so as I was saying, sorry, I got distracted, um, which happens a lot with me. My brain goes off into a different topic, and then I forget what I was talking about. But yeah, at the beginning of the match, like, he hit the fang, or he took out the fang, I guess. Put her on a hook, and then he had, like, a slug going on a little bit. And so I was trying to get, like, everybody up and everybody, you know, because I'm a big altruistic player. I like to make sure my team survives. And then as soon as Fang got off the hook, boom, he went right back for her. She didn't end up going down and going on hook, but we ended up getting her up. Every time I tried to take a protection hit for this Fang, and it was a little bit for Yui and Jeff too, but it seems like it was more focused on Fang. Or you can just stand by the Literally, like I stood there, pushed the killer into a corner almost, because he was over. being blocked by a pallet. Shit. Okay. Didn't even bother with me. Literally had these blinders on for other people. Luckily, like, I'm glad they got me in the end, but I felt like I needed to bully them a little bit to show them how their playstyle was going. Not very good. But I think they were brand new to Killer. Or Legion. Because, as you see, I was running there and they just kept swinging. I think they were probably newer to Legion. So I apologize to them that I played that way. But I'm very much into my team. I'm going to try and get my team out of there. And not have one specific person be tunneled out of the game. Anyway, or so. Thank you, Brad, so much for the shout-outs. 
I'm a tiny dreamer, so I try to spread the word as much as possible. Aw, well, that's super nice of you. And I, I'm the same. Like, I still consider myself a tiny streamer. Like, I don't, I don't think I'm no big time streamer or even mid streamer. I consider myself a tiny streamer as well. And I love to show the love to others. I love to spread the word. We love to give shout outs to everybody for that reason. So that it can show, you know, everybody what you're capable of doing if you are a streamer with the clips on stream. And just show, like, the support. Because, you know what? In this kind of world and in this, I don't want to say in this site, but on Twitch, it's very hard to get a footing anywhere. And I've been lucky enough to find a footing that I love and I found some amazing friends. And I wouldn't change anything for anything. It's hard. It is very hard. I've been streaming for three years. Almost four. And I know how hard it can be. Like, I've, I've taken breaks from streaming before because I just feel like I can't do it or anything. But I found a nice comfy spot now where it's like I'm really happy with where I'm at. And if I stayed in this position forever, I would be happy. But I'd love to grow as well because I would love to meet new people. I would love to meet new people, make new friends. But I've made some of the most amazing friends here already, so I would never, ever, ever complain about how I've gone about things or anything. Unless you flash me to Brad, let me tell the secrets! <laughs> Hi, Lunatic! How are you? And that's very true, too. Just a heads up, Scarlet sometimes forgets who she is and thinks her name is Magic. I do. I do. I'm sorry if I'm quiet lately. I feel no magic. No, it's all okay. You get your rest, sit back, relax, enjoy stream, enjoy gaming, enjoy whatever you're doing. I completely understand. You need the rest, relaxation, and everything. Sit back and enjoy whatever you're doing. It's all okay with me. You've been streaming for about a month. Nice. How are you guys enjoying it? Never apologize. Never apologize, Magic. You're amazing, and you need the rest and relaxation. I'm really new. It's definitely a process. It is. It is definitely a process. I completely agree. Like I said, I've been doing this for almost four years, but there has been times I've taken off months and months at a time because I just feel like it's too hard, or I get in my own head, and I feel like I'm not good enough, or whatever you know is going on at that time and so on and so forth, it's very hard. I am lucky, like, I will say it this way, I am lucky that Magic rated me way back when I was brand new, I wasn't an affiliate yet, and she showed me that love and support from then on out, and I kind of always look back at that raid as what helped me out the most. And then that's where I've met most of my friends, and I would never, ever change a thing. Like, you just, sometimes you gotta find, maybe like that one person you connect with, or maybe that one person who raided you, or that one person you raid into, or whatever, that will change. I don't want to say your life, because I don't know if that's just the big enough picture, but it's just that you need to, like, find that one, like, person, I guess. I don't know. I know what I'm trying to say, but I can't think of how I want to say it. I mean, you can't be right now if you want to be. If I could be you right now, Magic, to take away some of the pain for you, I definitely would do it. I definitely would do it for you, Magic. I'm doing fine, just enjoying some DVD. Well, how's DVD treating you today, Lunatic? My heart, that's so sweet, but it's true! We're one big happy community supporting each other. It's true. I will always say, like, our communities are blended, but we also have, like, kind of our own, like, little communities, you know, that some people don't obviously come over here, or some people don't go over there, or some people don't go to this one, or whatever. We have our own communities, but we also are one big blended community and everything, and I wouldn't change it. Because I always look back at who, who I consider my friends right now kind of came from that raid from magic way back before i was affiliated affiliated on twitch and i still have the message in my inbox on twitch when magic messaged me after the the raid and said i hope you get affiliate and from that on out i 
try my best to always be there and support her and then met a lot of you guys through magic and support you guys as well and i just consider like that what we've all built together is amazing and i think together we'll be building bigger and better communities or not bigger and better but you know what i mean bigger and a bigger community and more friends you know what i'm trying to say Magic is our connection piece between most of us. Yes, I will totally agree with that. Because that's where I met most of you all, is from Magic Stream. Or from Magic's Raid, or just connection there. And you know what? I will even say Magic is the reason I stream DBD. I watched her play it. I watched her play it a lot when she first started doing her Dead by Daylight games i was gonna say made it but she means it but she also plays variety as well and if you guys aren't following magic just saying go do so she is absolutely an amazing person she won't be streaming right now or not today i mean not right now but today because she's not feeling well but if you aren't following her go go i demand it she's amazing but she's also what got me into dead by daylight which is my main game now so I will also say that. She's also what got me to run head on. <laughs> Stop! You're too sweet. But it's true! I'm going to give the credit and the love where it's deserved. And like I said, uh, I watched you play uh, De Dead by Daylight. So I got into Dead by Daylight. Um, you made me play head on. <laughs> So now my my build became a head-on build because Magic redeemed it in chat. And after she redeemed it, I was like, I've got to learn this perk because Magic has redeemed it like two times. And I'm absolutely crap with it. So I practice and then I got good and now I love it. I follow. Well, thank you so much for following Magic. Like I said, she is a Dead by Daylight streamer. She also does variety. But she's currently um, down at the moment because she's not feeling well, but she will be back soon. And she does use a VTuber, but she also uses a face cam, so you get both the best of both worlds. And overall, she's just a sweet person. That's why she's my mod as well. You will truly not find a better friend and sweeter person than Magic, Scarlet. Oh, I'm an extremely close second. I will take the extremely close second, because I will put Magic up there, too. <laughs> I will. Wait, 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 look. in the air fire? What do we have in Brad? Look. What, what are you making, chat? What's in the air fryer for chat, Brad? Yeah, Thank you, Brad, so much for barrel. giving Magic okay. another shout out. See? Dead by Daylight. But she does play variety as well. Kind of like me. I reserve a specific day for variety. Magic plays variety whenever the hell she feels like it. But I have, I'm a person who I need a schedule in my life where I feel so out of whack. Okay, I'm trying to get to basement. Oh my god, it's Sadako! Oh, do this gen right here in front of the TV. It's fine. I am not. You are too, Magic. Shush. You are too such a sweet person. You do have those moments, though. <laughs> I mean, we all have those moments. I think she's above us, so I'm just going to stay here. See if she leaves. I don't know if that was sneaky enough, but... No! I'm trying to decide what to do because I thought she was right there. She committed to Colada though. Cooking turkey meat and gonna make... Ooh gonna make it into a chili that sounds yummy see if I can stay on this gen <gasps> that's really what magic was saying <laughs> she scared the hell out of me 
I'm a run, 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 run. Run, 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 and then I will reach out. I need to stun her one more time with a pallet, though. Oh, 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 that's not the way to go. Trying to find somewhere to plot myself on Gen 3 chat. I think this is solo gen, which I freaking hate, but I'll do it. I'm very much the person of, I do what the fuck I want, yes! And I don't find any problem with that. Because I'm the type of person who, I kind of do that, but when it comes to, like, streaming, I'm a very scheduled person, because otherwise I get all out of whack. And, um, then it just, things go downhill. I am definitely not a sweet person. I'm pure evil, but people love me anyways. Well, that's, that's why we love you. Because you're pure evil and we wouldn't change it any other way. <laughs> Just gonna try and commit to this gen with my resilience, being so low gen. I'm not a sweet person or else liquid lava would not be pouring from my body. Oof. Oof. Punishment at its finest. Nah, 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 nah. Dang it. I couldn't get my head on to commit or commit to charge fast enough. I didn't know we were all here. Holy crap. Let's go, Ada. Oh, never mind. I see why she did that. You are an amazing person. You are an amazing and sweet person too. That's why I picked you as my first lady. Very true. Very true. No regrets. Uh, chanting from Butter the Squirrel to oh, changing, chanting, changing from Butter the Squirrel to Poe the Raven. Poe is not trying to hump everyone and everyone around the valley. That's good. Also, magic got me into Dreamlight Valley, too, if you want to do that. Go that far. <laughs> you want to do that? You can go ahead and do that. You can do that one. I was going to play it anyways, but... I was watching magic play it right when it first came out. To a gen! Oh, that one's done. Okay, um... Bam. Ma'am. Ma'am. Okay, I need to find a gen. I gotta go this way. Claudette's working on that gen. I guess I'll do this gen down here. No, that might three gen us. Let's go. No, I was trying to get the pallet stunned because... I needed one more. One more for the challenge. So I was trying to commit to the pallet stun there. It's okay. Red panda! Ooh, can do, can do. I will do that right after this match. Oh no! Haunted ground! Luckily, that person was already injured though. So hopefully by the time, that's a long wait. Run, run, Kate, run. No, run, Kate, run. She can down you with one hit. Well, me too, but. Doesn't matter really if I've got if she hits me if she can commit to me. Frick! Well, I was saboing that hook for her.
Okay, let's do that. I know the Ada is injured. But... Oh, that was her death hook. Oh, no. But I was just going to say, she needs to come take some aggro. She's only got one hook. Okay, I can't see Chad at the moment because Maddie, my cat, is currently standing in front of it. That's why I haven't read it yet. <laughs> Maddie is awake and she's like, oh, may I talk to everybody? Manny, I can't see chat. Sorry. I, oh, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I was trying to cancel, but I was looking at Maddie. Maddie, what are you doing? You can have the rest of this med kit because it's almost empty. Uh-oh. Oh, we got this. We got this. Are you trying to say hi to everyone, Maddie? There you go. Oh, that was her death hook too. Okay. I don't know where the doors are, Ada. All right, there's not a door over here where I thought. Okay, that's okay. If she finds me, she finds me. It's okay. Ada has no hooks, but I wouldn't be upset that she found me and took me out, not her. It's be okay. Ah, damn. I don't have another. Oh, let me see if I can get this pallet stun. Just for my challenge. I got it! Let's go! Two pallet stuns in a match! You can doubt me now. It's okay. I'm hoping Ada's out of doors to get herself out. No! Ada, no! Be free! Be free! Where are we going? Maddie, no. No, if you step on that, you'll turn the computer off. I will! Okay, let me get my cat down real quick. Love you, baby girl, but you can't be up there. Alright, I'll put the red panda on. Let me read through chat that Maddie was blocking. Well, thank you, SK, but over the course of what I've been through the past three years, which basically ended last year, I got kind of reforged. Claws are always ready, but there are a few ex people exceptions. I get ya. I get ya, though, Denny. More dark than evil, maybe? That's a better way to put it. More dark than evil. Well, I think you're an amazing person, Denny. I know everybody goes through their own struggles and their own challenges and bad times and all that. Believe me, I've been through my share as well. GGWP! But I think you are a lovely person, and I love having you here. And I wouldn't change our friendship for anything. GG's tried to come assist you. It's all okay. It's all okay though. I don't mind dying. Sorry. If I hope they're still here. I was I was reading chat. But it's okay. They said, tried to come assist you when I found you on Bond. It's all okay. I was just trying to get as far away from her as possible. And I think I got my challenge done, which was really kind of what I was aiming there for at the end. I pretty much knew I wasn't going to get out, but I was able to get that last pallet stun on her. So I finished all of my survivor challenges. For the current tome, excuse me. Not all survivor challenges. I got a whole crap ton to go. But that was my last one in this current tome. Um, so I guess we're just going to have to go and play some old survivor ones. What am I... Oh my god. Yeah, that's right. Finish repairing four gens while using the perk Dark Sense. Um...
completed in a single trial. You know what? I'm just gonna stick it on. I don't need the BP. There's a lot of other challenges I could do, but I would like to try and get this one done. I really don't think I'll probably ever get it done unless I get a match that is... Everybody else is off farming with the killer, and I'm just be like, no, sorry, I'm focused on just four gens for myself. But I don't know if that'll get done. But we're gonna give it a good try. Um, we'll play with Cheryl for a little bit longer. Dark sense. I don't even know really what dark sense does. Boon. What's it even look like? Let's not be purple for me. Does Cheryl even have it? Deja vu, kindred, dark sense. I do. Each time a generator is completed, dark sense activates. While dark sense is active, the killer entering a 24 meter radius around you reveals their aura. Oh, okay. For five seconds. Once the aura is, once the aura's dur duration expires, dark sense deactivates. All right. Well, that's not necessarily a perk I really love. But it'll do, I guess, for this challenge. All right, let's go. Save, Scarlet. You're one of the reasons I was doing better when this was at its worst. Was looking forward to your streams more than ever during that period of time. Oh, Danny. I'm so glad that I could at least help some way or another. I know that we are so far apart when it comes to, like, you're way over there, over in Europe, and I'm way over here on in California. So any way I could help is always... I, we're playing against a Swift. <laughs> any way I can help, I always love to hear it. I'm glad that I could. And I'm glad that I could provide that for you. I really am. And I always... I know always, like, with me, when things are happening, I don't always like open up about it to others because I don't want to and I know that you're very much like that as well and I've always told you I'm always here for you but if you always need to step away if you always you know don't want to talk or anything or you do want to talk either either or you do what's best for you and I'm always here to support you and help you through anything however you need it like I said if you want me to shut up I will shut up you want to talk i'm here to talk and same goes for just about anybody my dms are always open if you want to talk about anything my dms are open in discord you can always dm me i will promise that i'll get back to you right away because i don't get on sometimes when i'm off line meaning just not on a streaming day like yesterday and the day before i was on in the morning but i wasn't on until the next day so it might take me like a day to get back to you but it's my dms are always open if you need to be to just shut up and bo bother you, I will do that too. If you want to sit here, lurk on my streams and listen to me be an absolute idiot, I will do that too. I'm the best at that. <laughs> but I am always here for you guys. Just sometimes it might take me an extra minute because I do always have my own personal problems because I do struggle with social anxiety. I have a... Uh, anxiety in general i have ptsd um i have brain issues not really but i mean i forget sometimes things very easily but i try my best to always be there for everybody in one way or another just always remember oh, to not play against pinheads um you come first not my streams not anything you come first not him finding me already. I'm not here. We're talking. Pinhead, go away. We're having a moment. Bug off. <laughs> See if he leaves. Pretty much, yep. I will vouch for that. We've been DBMing for two days about cheese lube. Pretty much, yep. Because I was on yesterday morning. And then I didn't get back on until this morning. Some days when I'm not streaming, I just get off onto, like, doing something else, or, uh... She sounded like she was moving really fast, but I wasn't watching. Or, I'm just busy with life as well. She's 
Cheese Lube? Yes, we were talking about Cheese Lube. Me and, uh, me and SK were. <laughs> and apparently it came over from also um, SK and Denny talking about it as well. That's why it leaked into my DMs. <laughs> Lulu Shoebox, hello! Welcome on in, by the way. That is just kind of one of the topics sometimes we get on here. We have interesting conversations sometimes. Okay, I finished one gen. Oh, damn it. Why did you come upstairs? Trying to get over. Never mind. I need to get to that box. What'd you? Okay, I'm going the long way, I guess. I need to get over to the box that he'll probably. Oops, that's not a way. Come to. Oh, somebody got it. Damn it. Okay, fine. I'll go do something else. You know what I should be bringing? Holy hell, I should be bringing things for gen speed to do this challenge. Well, it's, yes, it's a long story. But that is sometimes the things we talk about. <laughs> if you're trying to um, find a place where we talk about some of the most fun and interesting things, you'll find it here. And I wouldn't change it at all. Imagine cheese and bacon loop together as one. Yes. Ah, ah, no, sir. I'm imagining bacon and cheese loop. Leave me alone. I don't know how he lost me. No! I have to finish all the gens now! And he's also got the perk that, I forget what it is, blocks gens when one is done. A cheesy bacon sandwich between the buns. <laughs> yep. There's something called butter! Bo wait, bully butter too? As well as unicorn spit donut lube. Oh my god, these things. I kind of got to look these things up now. <laughs> Brad, you are no angel. Nuh uh. I don't believe it. Cheese and bacon fries is what put me in this mess. Oh, <laughs> no. Oh no! Is that what you ate, Magic? <laughs> what an unfortunate conversation, then. Ah! Oh, frick! Oh, oh no, she got her black people. Oh god, that, that freaked go. me out! That made me think that it really was somebody knocking on the door. It sounds so real. Where the hell is the box? It's over here! I thought someone had touched the box recently. Hi, Walkin! How's it going? Oh, let go of me. Welcome on in! I'm trying to get to the box. Ooh, dear, he's... I don't know if he's going for the box. Okay, I've got him distracted, hopefully. No. Oh, then he's got Franklin's. What the hell? He's trying to get to the box. Boy, can't. Thank you, Brad, so much for giving Walkin a shout out. I'm gonna head on Stunna, but. Okay, someone got the box. So I think he'll be going over there. Let's go with me. Well, I'm not getting my challenge done.
damn it. It's going good, finally feeling better. Well, I'm glad it's going good, and I'm glad you're finally feeling better. And I'm doing good, thank you. Sorry, I was trying to figure out where he's coming from. I'm doing really good. Oh, he's over there. Where'd my med kit go? It's probably dead, though. We've been having fun in chat today talking about cheese lube. <laughs> and then overall the last few days since I've been streaming. Good. I kind of relaxed the last few days. Got some things done around my house. And overall just been feeling really good lately. Actually, no, this is Nothing compared to what magic's going through, but I actually woke up not feeling well last night, night and I thought I was going to be sick. Like, today? But I don't know what it was. I just woke up... Not feeling well. Kind of got nervous, because I didn't want to miss stream. But then, um, I went to the bathroom, and everything was better after, so... I don't know. Today's games have been kind of weird. Uh, the first one we got, the Legion, was just very, um, I think, new at the game. So I don't know what their, like, focus was. Oops, sorry. No, he's going to finish it. It's pretty much almost done. I was going to let him finish it, and then I was going to heal. That's what I was trying not to do, to alert him where we were, but it's okay. I think he's on the other Jake. See what I mean? Every killer today, I try and take a hit for them. And they just go around me. It was the same with the Legion. Okay, I'm gonna go over here, get everyone healed. We'll go back for the, we'll go back for the Fang. Cause this is definitely a Swift. It's Hex Daddy, Hex Baby, and Hex Mommy. Okay. Oh no, and hell yeah, I love that you had a, ha have had a good few days. Maybe I just needed to expel whatever it was was causing me. It was like it was painful Like I was like really like I was like, oh, no, like I'm gonna get like really sick or something But whatever it was I got rid of it They're with her so that she's probably communicating where she's at Actually, you know what is he gonna touch the box? Yeah, here, I'll even do this. Hopefully he'll come over here. Oh, she's at the other door. She got out, good for her. All right. I got out. But anyway, <laughs> yeah, whatever it was, it passed. So I was really happy because I like I thought I was going to be really sick because I was in some pain last night and got up, went to the bathroom, even came back to bed, was still feeling not good. And then my cat was like, hey, I want to play around and do things. I was like, no, Maddie, come on. I'm like not feeling well. And then I finally fell asleep. So I got rid of it some way or another. And then I got some sleep, so. So, I think, why? 
I keep getting paired up with, I feel like, new killers again. Hex play thing. Oh, Deadlock. That's what it is. Deadlock. And then Franklin's taking my really crappy med kit, but I don't blame him. There was two flashlights. Oh, I'm out of coffee. Well, that's not fun. Put that over there. So I'll stop trying to drink it. Oh, the red panda! Brad! You didn't remind me. I forgot. I'm sorry. Let's go stick the red panda on. I got so sidetracked by, again, cheese lube. <laughs> Let's see. Where's my red panda? Here she is. All right. So we will re... We will re... We will use red panda for so many matches. We'll go from here and see. Bacon cheeseburger lube. Yep. That's what I got distracted by. Maddie, what are you doing? Okay, give me back my sweater. It's all gravy. I totally forgot about it. I looked over at my activity feed and I saw it. All right, I've got one hand because my cat has the other hand. Can I have my hand back, Maddie? For those of you who are new here, Maddie is my kitty. And she sometimes likes to be the center of attention. Like right now, she's got a hold of my right arm. So I can't get to my mouse. <laughs> Trying to know debate if I want to go play killer. Should we try killer? Can I have my thank you? Let's go give killer a try for the day and see what it's like. Cause normally how I play here, I play survivor until I survive, then we switch and play the killer we survived against. And we just survived against Pinhead, who I actually kind of enjoy playing. So I think I'm gonna switch over, see what it's like, and see if I'm having a fun day in the fog. It's killer wise, I mean. We tried on Wednesday and it wasn't very fun. Like, I, I just wasn't having fun. It was nothing against everybody playing. It was just me in general not having a blast. Um, I'll just go with this. So, Awakened Awareness, Call of Brian, Eruption. You know what? I've actually kind of gone back to my oppression. That's Ruin. Uh, Build, because I kind of like that better. No, oh, that's overcharge. Ooh, do I have it higher? Never mind. I may have it higher. Thank you, Brad. Yes. If you guys don't know who Maddie is, that's who she is. She's got some pictures on my Instagram. I think I posted some on Discord as well. But I'm really bad at posting pictures of her. Oh, kitties! Yes! I gotta go to the store, but I'll be back later. Have good games? No worries! Have fun at the store if you can. And thank you, I will do my best to have the best of some games. Safe travels to the store as well. <gasps> play on keyboard? I can do that. Do I play Pinhead on keyboard, Denny? Or do you want to pick a killer? Or survivor? Whichever. I'm wondering if you can help me? Maybe. Do you know how to make an infinite Discord link? I do. I do. I can tell you here in just one second. It's pretty simple. It's downstairs with mom, and the other one is asleep on the s She's asleep on the scratcher. Oh, so, I, wait, is it like one of those, like, board ones? That they're asleep on? Pinhead, yes? Okay, can do. I can play pinhead on that. Let me go tell you how to do it real quick. It's pretty simple. I just gotta go see how to do it. Oops, wrong spot. Okay, so this is how I, I'll like walk you through it real quick. So if you're on Discord, like your Discord server, um, so go on to wherever you want to send them when they first come in. Mine is the front desk button. Then you just push to invite people. And then you can go into when that little thing pops up. It says, your invite link expires in seven days. Edit link invite. Click that little tiny button. And then in there, you can change how often it expires. And there is an option to expire never. Okay, it's one of, oh, it's one of those ball ones. Okay, that have the round cardboard scratcher center. Okay, we used to have one of those, yeah. I was thinking when you said scratcher, like, um like a standing pole one, then it dawned on me <laughs> that there was other ones. 
Because the ones Maddie has is the standing ones, and then she has one that's like an X, which she could sleep on. But um, I know what you're talking about with the ball. Sip, sip. Oh, I had it in my hand. Can do. Thank you so much for the sip, sip, fearless demon. And welcome on in. Thank you so much. You're welcome. You're welcome. I just had to figure out how to find it, but that's how you find it. Yeah, it's just that little tiny, little tiny, very small text that says edit, and then you can uh, change to expire it or not expire it or have a limit or so on and so forth. So that is how you do that. All right. So Denny has redeemed to play Pinhead. Well, no, we're playing Pinhead. He's redeemed to play on the keyboard. So I'm going to play this match on mouse and keyboard, which I haven't played since the last time we did, which is a little while ago. But we played with mouse and keyboard on Wednesday with Survivor. Oh my God, that was a freaking blast. I'm just going to keep Starstruck awake and awareness, I think. Kill eight survivors by any means, can do. We have two of the trackball ones. Oh, and an X one. My Maddie has an X one, but <laughs> she's sat on it. And she has sat on it so much that it cracked. So now it's like a very droopy X. <laughs> so it's not quite X shaped anymore. We don't have any of the ball ones anymore. We used to have one, but we don't have it anymore. And then the other two cats in the other room, they they have just like the ones that are just like a a piece of cardboard, like a cardboard box looking thing that's just sat on the ground because they like those the most. We tried to give um, the boy cats the X one, but they didn't like it. Oh, wait, no, they have one that's inclined that they like, but they don't like it to scratch on. They like it to lay on. Like, our other cat, Timmy, he will, it's, like, inclined very slightly. And he will, like, lay on the top of it. But his bottom will be on the floor, so he'll be, like, kind of, like, chilling on it and everything. He likes to sleep on that one. But for the most part, for scratching, they like the flat ones. Like, they would probably like the ball version one. They just don't have one. Curry has jumped onto the X1 and broke it. That's what Maddie did. Well, she didn't jump on it. She just sat on it. It's kind of old now. So, I mean, it still has plenty of life in it. Because she likes the um, her big giant tower more to scratch. And has used the X more. She scratches on it, but she uses it more to sit on. So after a couple... How long have I had it? Maybe a year or so? Of just sitting on it, it's just cracked. So now it's a droopy X. But Maddie is more into scratching, like, the poles. So we have, um... I have one really tall one for her, which you guys used to see in the background when I had a camera. Um, I used to have my camera pointed at it so you could see her all the time. She likes to scratch on that one, and then she has another one. Oh, we have a TTV air. <laughs> I usually get embarrassed by TTV air, so that's okay. Um, and then we have another one that is smaller that she doesn't seem to use as much. She likes her big giant tower. Right now, Maddie is just walking around the route. She's hanging out, I guess. I don't know. So we will re... We will play this match on keyboard, and then also we have the Red Panda currently on. We will use for two, three matches, or until I remember, it's on. <laughs> I don't know how many times I've been either like the Red Panda or a prop or something, and then I look over at my OBS, I'm like, oh my god, how long have I had that on? All right, tremendously hatch killer shack and Ormond. Didn't see what the other one was. Oh, it's mine. Killer Shack, Hatch, Ormond. Okay, I know where that is. This is their third X, and the first they didn't break. It's about a year old and worn out, though. Our boy cats, they will go through scratch pads, like, once every couple months. 
They freaking love those scratch pads. But Maddie, she's just more into her like big giant tower. I've actually had to replace the rope on that twice. So uh, the like the, they're the rope kinds, and I have to buy the replacement rope and then rewind it every. I think this is the second time I've rewound it in about three years. And it's due for another one. Probably for Christmas she's getting rope to rewind on her tower or to scratch. Cause she she's she likes the X and she does use it, but I've had it for like maybe a year, maybe even two now. And she kinda scratches it, but mainly it's to sit on. But it is time to replace all the, the woven rope on her, um... Oh, I'm playing on keyboard! Sorry, sorry, it's such a habit. Keyboard. It's such a habit to pick up my controller. Alright, mouse and keyboard match. One time this went really well, and one time it didn't. Opened it. There's everybody. Quick and quiet, Nia. Whoopsie! Girl, I bought a keyboard. You can't do with things like that. Already lost her. No, I see him. He's going up there. That's cool beans. I almost couldn't figure out what to push there. Ooh, good one. Let's open this up. Let's go back to this gen and kick it. Or not. Oh, he's got sprint burst, so let's not let's not with that. I think he has sprint burst. He took off real fast. Okay. I'm gonna kind of let them get main done, I think. Who keeps popping it? Well, maybe I'll go over there and see what's going on. Did I get it done? Good. Cause me and I don't like guarding so much. The box. You opened it. Because of the upstairs and everything. I came. All right, I probably won't get... I probably won't get any kills this match. Let's see, let's put you over here. There's another boon, which is probably in the Michaela. Ooh, if we could kind of stay over here, we could force maybe a three gen. Let's go see what this gen's doing and if this is the boon they just did again. It is not. Okay. I should have kicked that gem before I left. I came. I 
could tell, I'm running against a little bit more experienced people. Just by the way they're running. They're a little harder to catch. Thank you. Okay, let's chase her up. Let's go get this pallet out of the way. Oh, she's not going to do that. And I even went around it and it still got me. Thought I was in the clear. That's why I didn't look up. Michaela's around. Is there oh, there's a raid! Avery, hello! Thank you so much for the raid! Welcome on in, raiders. I'm currently in the middle of a killer match, so I apologize if I'm not paying as close of attention. Which way it goes. Hello. I'm already down to two gens, unfortunately. One gen. Oh my gosh, please. Let's just break this. Oh, dang it. <laughs> but I've kind of met my match in this game. I have not been able to really oh. catch them or commit. The nemesis? Damn, I got one Woo! hook. I got oh one gosh, hook please. this whole match. Oh, I'm so mad. I'm so mad. Oh my gosh. That was pretty good. Yeah, Zemi, what did he do? It's the, it's the Thanos looking one. Oh, Thanos. Come on, come on, come on. Damn it. I'm scared. I am normally way better at killer than Where this. Is he? Ah, he can do that! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh, not the zombie! Oh my gosh! Now it's just become a funny. I'm sorry, How I'm long screaming. can I chase him around this rock? Oh, I'm. I'm, I'm not I got even gonna bit. try and hit him. Oh I just want to go around this rock no, a million no, times. Please. I'm not no, even no, gonna no, 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 uh, hit him and catch him. How long can we loop the rock until he's like, I'm doing it. I'm looping him. Oh, I'm getting dizzy, sir. No, we're having Ace, get out of the way. We're having fun. I'm not even going to hit him. Ace, get out of the way. Get out of the way. We're having fun. Okay. No, you guys go ahead. I was having fun. They all took this game way too serious. Hi. I was just having fun. You guys took it way too serious. You made me sad. I'm gonna go pound in the corner. I was just chasing him around the corners for fun. Let me go pout. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Everything you get so much for the rain. And Bagel, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. I'm going to pout in a corner. I just wanted to have. I was just trying to have fun. I was just having fun, and you took away all my fun. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, where did where did everybody go? Yeah, yeah. Thank you for caring. I appreciate you. Thank you for caring. Thank you. You can go. You can go. I don't mind. You can go. You could that that's the door. It's right over there. That's the door. You can go. It's all okay. I forgive you. I was just chasing him. Oh. Oh, thank you. Yes, you can. No, you go. You go. You you go. 
You go. No, you you go. No, you go too. No, you. Oh, look at this medkit. Oh, but but you you left me a medkit and everything. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Oh, no, you go. You can go. Michaela, don't don't sacrifice yourself for me. Oh, this I love you. You are my new best friend. Thank you. <laughs> Sorry for that loop. Oh, I was just having fun. I was after I realized I wasn't really gonna have any chance of anything. I literally was just running around the rock to do the loop. <laughs> Alright, let me go back and thank Avery properly so much for the raid. But thank you, Drury, uh, Dr. Maisky? Am I saying that right? right? Welcome on in, everybody. Thank you so much for the raid again. Chris V, by the way, Bagel. Avery, thank you so much for the raid. Welcome on in, everybody. My name is Scarlet. I am a Dead by Daylight streamer. I play Dead by Daylight 2 out of, uh, hopefully that Michaela. DWP. Thank you for being amazing. I don't know if anyone's console or not, but um, raid view. I will have a raid view in just one moment. But let me introduce myself. My name is Scarlet. I'm normally a Dead by Daylight streamer. I play Dead by Daylight two days out of the week, and then we play Variety. One of those days, which on Monday we will be playing the new uh, Resident Evil DLC that came out about two weeks ago or so, so we'll be playing that on Monday. I normally am a survivor main, but I do play killer when we survive, and when things aren't going so well in the match, like that one didn't go well, I literally just like to try and have fun. So Taco, you were perfectly fine. It was all okay. I was looping around the rock just for funsies. I wasn't going to hit you at all. Then Ace came over, and I was like, no, Ace, leave me alone. I'm just trying to chase Quentin around the rock just for funsies. <laughs> But you all did amazing. It's just, I haven't played Killer in a little while. So I was just not really in the groove, which happens. Sometimes you're playing Killer or even Survivor. You just don't find that groove. So it's all okay. GG's to you as well. I was the Quint in that match. It's, I got you, I got you. And it's fine. I The, the loop. I was having fun with it. I don't get too angry at anything in this game, really, unless um, somebody's doing something, like, extremely toxic. But <laughs> after, um, I was going to down you, and then I think I missed, like, one hit. And then I was like, oh, screw it. You know what? The game's over. They're probably at the doors. It's all okay. I'm just going to go ring around the Rosie with this Quentin. And then I started getting, like, dizzy, and I'm like, oh my gosh, I don't know how much longer I'm going to be able to keep this up. So in a way, like, when Ace came over, I was like, no, Ace, leave me alone! I'm just running around a rock! But in a way, I was kind of glad he was there, because I was starting to get dizzy from our loop-de-loop -loop around the rock. <laughs> but I appreciate that, Michaela, for staying in the match at the end. It wasn't needed, but it was really sweet of her. She gave me her med kit and also stayed, so I appreciated her. But she could have got. I would have been okay with it. It's all okay. But Avery, what were you up to today? I'm sorry. How was stream? Oh, you played some DBD. Nice. How was your time in the fog today, that Avery? Everything go good. Stream was amazing. And thank you, Magic, for posting that. When I do play Killer, I am, like, focused. Unless nothing is going on, then I will look over at chat, but... I try to keep my focus on killer to make it either fun for everybody or if I'm doing good. But oh, the Michaela gave me a one kill. Oh, I didn't realize that counted as a kill. I didn't realize when, it, well, I guess technically, yeah, she didn't escape. So yeah, but I didn't know that actually counted as a kill in the challenge. Right? Sometimes the new meta is run around the rock, right? Like I said, I like to get 4Ks, but when I know the match ain't going my way, I like to just have fun. You know what? In the end of the day, it's a video game. As long as we could have some fun. And then after we uh, got off the rock, I went over into a quarter and pouted because I was such a bad killer. <laughs> but it's okay. I, did, I didn't beat it. I was just playing. 
I went into a corner and I pouted. <laughs> but you all did good. You all did amazing. I had a lot of fun nonetheless. And that's all that matters. It was good. Played some killer games. Nice. How did the killer games go? Did you get a lot of good good uh, kills? A lot of 4Ks? A lot of uh, ring around the rock style gameplay like we just did? <laughs> playing Pinhead. He's a lot of fun to play. Just wasn't my match, and that happens. I was also playing on mouse and keyboard, which I am better at when it comes to killer, but it always takes me a hot second to get the controls down and everything, so I got it, though. I got it. All right, well, again, Avery, thank you so much for the raid and trusting your community over here in Skellytown. I really appreciate that. I have a raid video to show you all to introduce myself to show you guys a little bit of what you can expect from me when I'm playing Dead by Daylight. So sit back and enjoy this raid video. Here, there's my ass! <laughs> y'all see, Dead by Daylight just showed off my ass. Please be a toolbox. Please be a toolbox. Let's go into toolbox. Oh, you can have that. That's empty. <laughs> Don't you dare come out of this locker. <laughs> I said, Don't come out of the locker, sir. Or ma'am, or whatever the hell you are, creature. Wraith, please be nice, please be nice, please be nice, please be nice. Oh, oh my god. No, please! Oh, you a-hole! <laughs> oh my god, my ass, it hurts so bad. My ass hurts. over here i appreciate that so much and i promise to take the best of care of them as possible and yes that is what you can expect to see on my channel a lot of me screaming a lot of me yelling apparently a lot of me about my ass hurting or something in that fact and a lot of me just getting excited over the little things like you know getting a really good blink on a nurse that isn't even really that good but it's 
exciting to me. So that is what you can expect to see here. And like I said, overall, just trying to have fun. It's a video game. We're here to have fun. I will admit sometimes I get a little upset in the game because, you know, you got a bad streak or whatever. But for the most part, I'm all good. I'm, you know, just here to have fun. If something bad happens, I might get a little upset, but then we move on. We do move on. Love the raid video. Thank you. It was really fun to make it. And then I just really love a lot of those clips. It, it just it reminds me of some of the fun times we've had in the fog. Because I normally play Survivor, but I've tried to like put in a couple of my really good killer plays or just interesting things I've said on stream during my killer games. Maybe a cheese loop to stop that ass hurt. Maybe. Uh, I might have to look into that. <laughs> and yes, we do talk about some of the most random and interesting and fun things here as well. Like cheese loop. It's a long story. It's a long story. We are switching over to Kate real quick. We um, rolled a roller and we're supposed to be playing a Cheryl for a little bit. But I also have a challenge to successfully open one exit gate with Kate. I'm going to give it a try for a few minutes to see if I can get it done. If not, we will roll the roller and see who we should play again. Since we just played a Cheryl like a stream or two ago. And we played Kate quite a bit recently because she got the new outfit. So I'm going to see if we can roll and see if we can get somebody else we haven't played in a while. But we'll be playing as Kate for a match or two to see if I can open an exit gate. Also, after this match, I'm going to try and make a build that's um, more gen progression. Because I have an old, 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 old challenge from the very first tome that I'm working on because I'm done with all my survivor challenges in the current tome. I have an old one that is repair four gens in a single match with the dark sense uh, perk. Well... Four gens in a single match these days is hard because of the they've changed how long it takes to finish a gen. But if I can get maybe a gen progression build and then hopefully maybe get a killer that's like focused on one survivor or a farmer who's got everybody sidetracked. Because I've done that before. I've had a killer like farm in a game. And then I'm just over there in a corner doing all five gens. Which is fine. I don't mind. But it's got challenges done that way. But I'm going to give it a good old try to get four done in a single match. It's just a little bit harder because since this challenge came out, gen, uh, they've upped the time on to finish them. But I did not put it on this match because I ran out of time and I didn't want to sit here and try and find a build. My raid video was almost done. I wanted to focus on that. Oh, Garden of Joy. A big map will help, too. Oh, I can go back to... I don't need my mouse and keyboard anymore. A big map will help, too, because um, hopefully maybe, like, he'll be looping someone. Him, her, them, whoever it is. What is this? Spicy is what it is. Um, I don't remember what I was saying. But anyways, I saw something really shiny and I liked it, so. Sorry. Don't know what it was, but I took it out. Well, not getting Jens done this match. <laughs> Don't know how I got out of that. <laughs> I get Jens done this match!
You ain't getting your exposed on me. You pulled me out of this locker, sir. <laughs> same thing, almost same thing. No injuries on hook. Well, I ran him long enough for kept him distracted long enough that he um. Ow, sir! That's what you get. Bad they got a gen done. I may go say thank you. Thank you. No, no, go ahead. Go ahead. I was gonna go over the boon, but I don't know if he's coming back. Well, now I have to finish all the gens to get this challenge done, but. Okay, he's found Ada. What is this? Just circle of healing. Okay. Actually, I just have to finish four gens. If my entire team right now could like 99 them all and leave them for me to finish, I would love that, but I'm not gonna ask for that. <laughs> Uh, have to raid and run, but I hope you have a great stream and love the raid video again. No worries. I completely understand. I do the exact same a lot of the time. Self-care after is very important. But again, thank you so much for the raid and hopping on in. And I'm glad you... Oh, Leon! I'm glad you loved <laughs> the raid video, but I hope the rest of your day is amazing. And I will do my best how her to have her a good rest of my stream for we... sure <laughs> it's mine it looks like like a bucket do we see this me and my i don't know where bucket. that first gen pops <laughs> oh my gosh oh my gosh it looks like a uh, popcorn <laughs> it is a building in the sims <laughs> earlier Today, I kind of want to sit down and play some now. Nice! I've been wanting to play The Sims recently, too, but... Again, I don't want to, um... I don't want to repair all my mods that are broken. <laughs> but I do... I did want to play some Sims recently. It's just kind of relaxing. Is that him? quiet was still on that's why I was doing that I'm not having a good game so I'm just kind of playing with the killer at this point but I think he's getting angry at me I think he's getting kind of angry at me thank you Brad so much for the shout out by the way I don't know if I said that I think I did but I don't think I did go back to this gen. I don't know if he'll go after me since I'm on second hook, but he might. I think I've made him angry. Maybe not. It is. I was building while watching a few episodes of Handmaid's Tale with Maria. Nice! I haven't built anything in The Sims in forever. It used to be like my main thing on stream. Like, I was a sim streamer, but I built more than played games. Or, like, played the uh, gameplay of it, I mean. And I kind of miss it at times, but at the same time, I get kind of frustrated by it, because it's, like, not coming out the way I want it to, if you know what I mean. 
Which I know a lot of people know what I mean if they're Sims builders. But it's just like a nice relaxing and calm game to play. Ooh, decided to make a mausoleum vampire nest in Moonwood Hill Mills. The werewolf world? I don't have that world. I have I'm so behind on packs for the Sims. The last one I bought, I think, was Trying to think of the name of it. The country one. Cottage, cottage, cottage living? Is that what it was? God, they finished the gens before I could even focus on this match. Hope they can get her out of basement. I'm trying to get healed. All right, I'm on my way. Uh oh. Oh, is he guarding basement? What? That is he playing with no head? Oh, a hail to the no. I don't know where totems are on this map. He's gonna basement them all. I found it. Let me go get this and then I'll go try and save them. I'm not gonna leave them behind, but I'm gonna get rid of this noed. This will give me a fighting chance to get them. Guaranteed he will probably be camping basement. Let's see if I can go the back way. Knew it. He wasn't gonna let us me get them. I knew he was gonna do that as soon as I grabbed them, so I had nothing to do. He was just playing angrily. You notice that? Like at the end? Right there at the end, he started to hit the Ada. Cottage living! Yes, that was the name of it. Okay, I knew it was cottage. And then I had to, I thought it was country living, but no, it was cottage living, yeah. There was like nothing I could do there because I knew as soon as he saw me because he was camping basement that he was going to grab me off the hook. There was like no way I was going to make that save. I should have gone in from the side, but I didn't know where he was camping. I thought he was going to be in the basement camping though. I took out Devour Hope at the beginning. Oh. Well, they just played kind of angrily. You could tell that they were an angry killer. Because, see, in my opinion, I probably would have let them get the people off the hook, or at least one of them, and did an exchange kind of thing. Because I don't like when people grab people on the hooks. Grab me off, Jen. It's okay. It's all good. I don't mind. But when you grab someone when they're trying to unhook, I think that's just kind of... I don't know. I know it's part of the game, but at the same time, I think it's just kind of nasty. I don't know why. It's just how I think of it. Um, when it comes to supernatural gameplay, vampires and spellies are my favorite thing to play as. It's been a while since I had some nice and fun gameplay with vampires. I will have to agree. Those are probably my two favorites. I never got the werewolf one because it didn't seem to be something I really, really wanted. But I wanted it for like the the cast and the build items and then also the world itself looked really nice. But the whole werewolf thing, I was just like, uh, it's fine. Cause I love the vampire pack and I really like the um spellcasters pack, whatever that was called. What was the spellcasters pack called? 
God, it's been so long since I played Sims. I'm forgetting all the things about it. But then um, the wedding stories came out. It was really glitchy. Never got around to it. And then also the newest pack, which was the high school one. It was very glitchy too. So I just kind of was like, I'll wait and get it eventually. Since I don't play as often. Um, I figured I would get it like when I had an idea with something surrounding one of those. If you know what I mean. All right, I'm going to try and make a build around um, gen progression. I feel bad for those people who are down in the basement. I was going to try and make it hardest, but after I realized what was going on, there was... I don't think really any way I could have helped. I'm going to keep fast track on... I have to have... What color is it? It's green. Okay. That helps. I have to have dark devotion on. Dark sense. Excuse me. Not dark devotion. What should I have my last perk be? I got proof myself if I can find somebody. I've got fast track if I can do... Uh, get people hooked or whatever. I can use that. Should I use something that's mainly... You know what? I want to try this. It's called Built to Last. Bring a really good uh, toolbox and then keep refilling it. That'll give me some speed. See what that does. Realm of Magic. Thank you. I had like, so, what was the, there was one back in the, like the original days. Hey, you're Kate. Kate is my main knight. I like Kate a lot. I like Kate a lot. I normally, uh, my main is usually Michaela, but on stream I like roll until I get a kill, or not a killer. I roll a roller and then I play with that person. But I have a current challenge that I need to open an exit gate with Kate. So I'm gonna try and play with her for a little bit and see if I can get the exit gate open with her. Cause we were playing Cheryl earlier, but I'll probably re-roll since we just played with her recently. On, um, uh, we got her on our roller, I mean. I don't have a lot of speed things in here either, because I've used a lot of her stuff. Just do that, I guess. Alright, let's see if I can do this. It's not the greatest of build. I could definitely put a different one in, possibly for... Like, built to last, or even prove thyself, but I'm gonna see if this works. Yeah, and I might have to just resort to that. I might just have to resort to hopping into a swift somewhere to do it. I'm gonna give it a good couple tries and see if I can get it, but yeah. I had them wait for me to finish the gens until- Yeah, that's what I was just saying. I was like, you know what I should- uh, and you need to do is like, have everybody do gens, and then when it's almost done, Run over to the gen that is almost done to finish. Because you just have to finish repairing the gen. The gen could be 99. I think as long as I finish it, it'll be good. That's what I was thinking. Making magic. I had that pack when it came out. One of the originals, which was... Uh, that was Sims 1, right? I don't think Sims 2 had a magic pack. I think it was Sims 1, but I had that pack, and that's what I was thinking of when you said um, spellcasters. I was like, no, no, it's not. That's not the name of it. That's the other one. That was a fun pack. If I have to like rank one of the older packs, like Sims 1 wise, that would probably be at the very top. I remember when I was a little girl, that came out. I was stoked for it can't tell you now if I got it right as it came out or if I had to wait because I didn't buy it I know that I was too little but I don't remember if I got it right away or if I had gotten it like for Christmas or something yeah it's either I think it's one if I'm thinking right but I'm not positive either I think two has good and evil magic I'm forgetting what two's magic is I don't 
I remember them having a magic pack, but... It might not have really been a pack. It could have been in the game. I don't know. Two is still my favorite, but two was definitely... I didn't have everything for two. I think Sims 1, I probably had everything. If not, maybe missing one or two things. Like, back when Sims 1 was out, it was simple. It was one thing. It wasn't stuff packs, expansion packs, what's the other hell to call the other packs? It had one thing, and it was just like a DLC, and it was that was it. So I probably had all of that. Sims 2, I know I miss a lot. Because that's when it was starting to get to where I was paying for it. So it was harder for me to get. I didn't play Sims 3 very much. And I had nothing for it. I had the original game. But I was so stuck on playing 2 that I never really played it. And then 4. I've got 2,000 hours in. So. Kins, hi! You're the Ada? Oh my god, I'm sorry! <laughs> I think I had a skill check, check there and I was reading chat. Well, good luck! Have fun, Ada! <laughs> yeah, sorry. That was my bad. Oh no! Sir! He's got undying, by the way. Undying and Franklin's. Making magic at Sims 1. That's what I thought, but I had to double think about that. This is my med kit. Or this is my toolbox that's dead. See, now my toolbox does me no good. Oh my god, I ran into that locker. I forgot I don't have my normal perks on. Okay, I'm totally playing trash this game. I'm sorry. I don't have my normal perks on and I'm kind of like confused what's going on. <laughs> but anyways, good luck, have fun, and I'm sorry I popped that gen, and I'm sorry I'm a trash player. I've got a new build on. And I thought I had head on quick and quiet there, and I don't. Now I've got a dead toolbox. Oh, the Sims 2 magic came with the apartment life pack? I had that pack, I think, but I don't know if I really played with it that much. I don't think I ever remember that. Damn. Oops, sorry. The apartment pack was one of my favorites because I really liked the addition to the apartments. I think the apartments pack was more fun than of uh, the city living pack. Like, I like city living and everything, but I feel like it's missing something compared to the apartments pack from... The Sims 2. Oh, Leon got up. Okay. Still carrying around this dead toolbox and I don't know why. I just picked it up because I thought I had some left.
haven't played against a demo puppers in forever. My build to oops, that's not the way to go. I'm still not used to RPD. Guess I'll go this way. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, I'm right here. Where'd he go? Hi, Maria! I tried to restore it, but it wasn't working. I, it must have like a little bit left in it or something. Oh, why are you camping? Oh, he's not, he left in his butthole. I need to go see if it's got like the littlest sliver of health in it. Cause when I picked it up and then I tried to go in a locker, it wouldn't recharge. Let me see. Oh, it had the sliverest of health in it that I couldn't see. Okay, let me go recharge it. Cause he had Franklin's. So when I picked it up, I thought it was dead. So I got in a locker and it wasn't recharging, so I thought something was like raw, like something broke in my game. But nah, uh, it had so much left in it that I couldn't even see it. But I could lose it again. Alright, I'm on my way for you! Where, where, wait, where, where? <gasps> there's a, there's something spicy up there. I know he's got on dying, is that this? I was trying to go through that hole. I wasn't sure if that was going to work or not. Ooh, let's go team! Let's go team! Now I have no idea what happened to my med kit, or what happened to my toolbox, but it's gone or now. Trying to get to the other side of the map. I thought I heard footy prints. That's why I stopped. I, there was, I was tested it. It literally had a sliver. Oh, is he tunneling? Thank you. Is he tunneling, Leon? I just feel like he's is playing like really weird if you know what I mean but that makes sense he's if he's tunneling Leon and he's the obsession frick I hate this map I freaking hate this map I 
went the absolute wrong way because I was trying to go over here and... I'm on a map I'm unfamiliar with. What? Really, Magic? Oops, this way. No way! Alright, no worries, Brad. No worries. Go lay down. Take care of yourself. It's all okay if you're not feeling good. It's okay. I didn't really have anywhere to run and I didn't want him to start knocking down us all so that poor Leon would have to go for the unhooks. Today and he was only- yeah I was gonna say he was right around my age! Damn! That's so shocking. I know he's had some troubles but I- didn't really, well, I mean, I don't know how he died. I'm not gonna make any assumptions. But I know he's been struggling for like the last, I don't know, like 10 years or something. Leon. We must go help. Fun. Okay, as long as Leon got free, I've still got a hook to spare. Hey, I died in front of a butthole. Not died. I'm laying on top of a dead butthole. They haven't said how. But he was found in his bathtub. Oof. That doesn't sound good. That does not point to good things. What say ya? That's like one way too young. Like I said, I know he's suffered, like he's had issues in the past. But I thought he was getting like better, so. This match is going to be a long match since he's not really committing to... Let's go, Leon! He's not really committing to hooking people. He finally hooked Bill. He actually did hook me, but he did knock me down already. not the way I thought it was anymore. <laughs> I will totally admit I thought that was an exit and there was not. Mm. 
My bad for running into that room. <laughs> the gens is on the line. How's DVD night? Interesting. Interesting. How are you doing, Maria? I'm sorry. I think I, I don't know if I asked that when you came in, but how are you today? It was so bad on European service, and I, Denny was telling me about it. Denny was telling me it was spicy in the fog today. I have definitely had killers being interesting. We'll put it that way. I have definitely had a lot of killers today be playing spicy. Okay, I'm gonna go over here and work on this gen. See if we can start getting this going. Oh, thank you! Leon. He doesn't deserve what's happening to him. Does not deserve what's happening to him at all. Let's go! Bill! Now he's gonna slug. Run, Bill. Run. Run. I'm gonna go this way. Go get them up. Go get them this is kind of how killers be playing today very 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 tunnely and to the fact where i don't care if i die he tunneled the leon hard at the beginning of the game i haven't really done a lot of gens for that reason and i will happily die to protect my teammates because damn, did he want to play a nasty style of game. We played a couple of matches and oof, we ended up just not doing skill checks on hooks in multiple matches. I definitely feel that today. I definitely feel that. The first match we had was a Legion who I literally, I, okay, it was Midwitch and you know that palette that's on the bottom level that you drop and then it goes upstairs i literally sat there and body blocked a killer and pushed them into a corner for them to never hit me because they wanted i think it was a fang and they had only eyes for this fang eventually they did start to hit other people but they were very tunnely the whole match to the fact where i felt like i was really um, like invincible, like I could stand in front of him and he like, he walked around me so many times, but we got all, we all got out. So this one, unfortunately I died, but it happens, you know, you can't get them all. Like right now he's basically just tuddling and camping or not camping and slugging now. We end up doing it the same way, barely able to do gens. Yeah. And that match was like, I wasn't even focused on gens anymore. It was all about trying to protect the one person who was pretty much being tunneled out of the game, but now it's become a slug match. I'm sorry you died. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. My main focus was trying to get everybody else up and out. I know I was on death hook. I could have been that kind of player who, after I saw I was injured and on death hook, I could have just run away from you guys, but I wasn't going to do that. I wasn't going to do that. I was going to try and protect you guys as long as I could. I'm trying to think. What was the other match? The pinhead match we played was okay. That one wasn't too bad. But this match, this demo, like, I thought it was going to be a fun match because demos are fun to play against. But this person is just not... See, now look what they're gonna do. 
They're gonna just watch the Ada, hoping she doesn't have either what? Deliverance or Kobe. I'm gonna leave the poor Bill on the ground to bleed out. I feel bad Leon was getting tunneled from the beginning, yeah. And once you brought that to my attention, I wanted to make sure that the Leon got out. But he didn't, he, we all died, but it's all okay. Like we all died for each other. That's the way I look at it. Not once did I feel like my team let me down. I think the killer just played nasty. Like he's still playing nasty. Oh, it was that ghost face. He had no head. The last match we played was a ghost face with no head. I found no head, but he had hooked everyone in the basement. And I was the only one left and I was uninjured. So I was trying to get down to basement to help. But he was uh, camping basement. And then as soon as I tried to help unhook everybody, he grabbed me. Which I think is a really crappy way to play. I want to see what perks he was running, because he had him dying. I'm kind of curious what else it was. You're awesome, though. Pumpykins? I like your day, by the way. But see, look! He did not get a 4K. He's only going to get a, maybe a 3K. This is exciting. I'm kind of curious what's going to happen here. Let's go! Oh, dang! GG's, congrats on a hatch! You deserved it. They were running with Franklin's we knew. That is so popular today. Everybody's got Franklin's. Undying Eruption. Oh! Oh, they had Devour Hope, too. Man, people play with Devour. People playing with Devour. Sleepy, but I don't want to sleep, but I do. Danny, if you need sleep, go sleep. I understand. I understand, but I, I also understand I need to stay awake, too. Because I'm the same. Mr. Is it Mi Ma Mr. Macias? Am I saying that correct? I mean, I really feel bad. About how that match went, like, we didn't deserve that kind of gameplay, but at the same time, Ada, you deserve that hatch. He only ended up getting a 2k after all that. He literally messaged me GG the killer? There's no GG to that, I'm sorry. I mean, I will GG you and my team, because I thought the team played well. Because I, as I was saying, like, what I thought was really awesome is, like, I didn't realize that... Leon was being tunneled because I just wasn't paying attention, so my bad. It just was not... I just wasn't paying close attention. But once you brought it up, I saw it. He had two hooks, and then I realized, yeah, he was constantly going after him. I just was not paying that close of attention. So then it became my focus was, no, gens aren't that important. It's at least getting Leon to have some life in this game, and hopefully take his focus off of the Leon. So I'm glad that we got to do that. I'm glad Leon wasn't the first to die. I don't care that I died, it happens. I feel like it was a good match from the survivors. Good games and I appreciate all the attempts to save everyone. Same, same. I loved that. I loved that. I'm also, I apologize, I'm playing with a build I'm not used to as well. I accidentally flew into a locker once thinking I had quick and quiet and I didn't. Oh, I did forget I was a red panda, Denny, thank you. <laughs> I did forget I was a red panda. Okay, let's go back to our other look. What was I wearing? Oh, I remember. I can fight it. As you guys can see, I have a lot of outfits. Maple hoodie. I was wearing the maple hoodie today. Thank you, Denny. I did forget that I was a red panda. We got extra red panda time. Not bad, but fun 
fighting game. You were the bill. Yeah, I thought you were the bill. I was going to ask and I got sidetracked. Sorry. <laughs> you did good as well. Like I said, after I realized what was going on, it was more to the fact where, okay. All right. We're going to have to switch our focus on trying to save everybody or at least prolong our lives in this game. And then hopefully we'll get a gen done. I saw you guys did get the gen done, so that was good to see. I'm glad we did get all five gens done. And yeah, the game didn't go our way, but it was still fun. I can't really complain about it other than maybe I wasn't into the killer's game style. But it'd be like that. Some days you just get those kind of killers. I still had fun. You guys were awesome survivors. I'm a very altruistic player, so I really do love to see when survivors, especially for me in solo queue, come together like that to save everybody. I just really like that. It, it really it really makes me happy. Would I have liked to survive? Oh hell yeah, I would have liked to survive. But I would have rather seen my team survive than me. Now I know that didn't happen, but I would rather me be the first out and hopefully everybody else could get out. Or prolong their life in the game, or get the last gen done, or get hatch! Like Ada got! It was really nice to see that you got hatch. Deserved. Sucks that Bill bled out on the ground, but at the same time, hey, the killer didn't get the kill. It is spicy in the fog, though. It is spicy today. But it is close to rank reset. Still a little ways away, but it is close. It is the weekend as well. I don't know if that plays into it at all. But I haven't had any problems with survivors. It's been the killers who've been playing kind of like, seriously? Me and Kate going for a walk. They've got corrupt, so I'm gonna do this, Jen. Cause lately, was it not Wednesday? Cause we played the P frickin' Sadako again. Um, it was a Monday. It was a Monday? Or maybe it was last week, even. I think this gen's corrupt. Yeah. I was having survivor problems. Like, I was having survivors who were playing weird. Which doesn't happen for me often. I will actually say I usually get a lot of great survivor teammates. Is that one over there also corrupt? My bad, sorry. My bad. Yeah, that was corrupt too. Whee! Okay, I'm trying to wait for this gen. That was my bad. I think I missed that skill check. Okay, I'm going to start on this gen. Use my build to last since I've got it.
You know what actually would be a nice perk that would go, um, not with this build, but that would help probably would be that new potential energy one. A 20% boost at like the most opportune time. She following you? Oh, he's doing the tape. Yeah, I never do the tapes. <laughs> I should, but I never do. to. I have to. That sucks. Woo! Dave, not David, sorry. Adam, where did you come from? Oh, frick, the lag! Oh my god, stop! Whatever's causing this lag! Oh no! to finish that gen Frick you Oh, this is it. Oh, it is! I wasn't in the boon. Okay, sorry, my bad. I thought it was not Circle of Healing, but I was just out of reach. Thank you. She's probably got Colibride. we're going to be able to do main. She's really focusing hard on it. keeps happening. Okay, I'll go down. That's okay. I will go down for that. I got three gens finished. I need to finish one more Jed. Oops, I'm not recovering. My bad. I'll crawl away. Nice! Going for the slug. Going for the slug. It's been the thing today. If you don't go for the slug, you're not in the it group. Okay, I am okay. I'm gonna crawl away though. If we're too close together, it's easier for her to um, guard.
We'll get you. We'll get you. Don't worry. Let me see. Ah. Not gonna go pick him up because I'm going to wait until he gets some. S not speed. Um. some progress and then I'll go pick him up oh she actually picked him up push that head on right now Such a good job at the slug, ma'am. You're such a good slugger. Good, they got him up. Toodles. That's a rock. You're still doing really good at the slug. I don't know. Killers be iffy. Killers be iffy today. Okay, I'm gonna get myself healed. Alright, I am all healed. Don't you stand over me like that. It's like we can't really focus on gens because we are all very focused on each other and I love that will we all get out of here because of that mm, probably not but I like to see the altruism like the team's not like screw you it's all about me I will totally hang out here until no they all got healed never mind I was gonna say until they all heal up So I think I'm right outside. Oh, no, I'm in the boon. Okay, let's go.
She finally got rid of it. Do I have enough in here to do this? I do. Darn it. Oh, let's go! Ooh, they got her off! Okay, I'm gonna see if I can focus on a gen for a little bit. We got some time. Let me refill this. This is a very, very concentrating game. Okay, I got some built to last. Let's see if we can get this gen done. That's only her first. We could probably do this. No. She, it's okay. She'll be okay. All right, gens are done. So now we can focus on getting each other out. No more having to think about the gen. Malay down. Have a good stream. All right, Denny. It sounds good. You get a lot of rest. Thank you so much for hanging out. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I've got a hook to spare. I've got a hook to spare. It's not the other cake. But anyway, sorry, I got sidetracked. Thank you, Daddy, so much for hanging out. Get lots of good sleep. Thank you again for everything. You are amazing. And I always love hanging out with you, so get some good sleeps. And I will see you hopefully. What's today? Saturday? Monday. Monday. I had to think about that for a second. I'm gonna try and get myself as far away from Nancy as possible. That's not how you pick up. I mean, I'll bleed out. It's not a kill for you. If I bleed out on the ground, you get less points for it. So I'm good with bleeding out. This Sadako doesn't know how to play this game other than slug and I died because she wouldn't pick me up so she got less points. I did it! Oh my god, I freaking finished four gens using Dark Sense in solo queue! And I pipped for that match so I'm happy. This Sadako can't play the game and she can only slug. But like I said, I'm actually happy bleeding out because she didn't get the kill. She didn't get it. I hope these three get out. They deserve it. Another round of Amazing Survivors. Focus mainly on trying to get everybody out. Joe, 
actually versed, versus uh, Sadako that did the same thing last night and had to DC so my friends could get a hatch. Totally understandable. This Sadako, the only thing she's gonna get is me dying on the ground. She's not even gonna get a kill for her game style. Polite! Hello! Thank you so much for fading Sally! But this has been it all day! This has been this all day. Killers are either tunneling, or slugging, or... Just playing like a-holes. Like, I, I don't, like, have any problem with what this Kate is doing. Oh, she's gonna get a 1k because the Kate stuck around. She gonna more air? Congratulations, you got one more. Actually, she probably wouldn't have got that if the Kate didn't mess around, but it's okay. Whoops, yeah. <laughs> I don't think that was the Kate's plan at all, but it's okay. It happens. Merciless Storm Corrupt, save the best for last. Oh, she had save the best for last. Maybe that's why she was doing a slug thing. I don't know. But, whatever. She, um, can play like that. It's good. How's it going today? It's going really good. It's going really good. Except for we're getting a lot of killers that are just absolutely just not. Killer also. GG's, right? <laughs> was it the last match? I think it was. The demo we had. Literally, like, was tunneling this Leon, and me, Bill, and Ada ended up trying to save the Leon more than do gens. And the Ada was in my chat, and they were console, and they said the killer actually messaged them and said GG. And I was like, what? There's no GG to that for that killer. Team? Yes! The Ada deserved the GG, because she ended up getting hatch. Not the killer so much. There you go. There you go. No, see the Kate? The way Kate was lying on the ground, she fell and couldn't get up. The tryhards are out in full force. They are! My teammates have been so amazing at being altruistic, trying to make sure everyone gets out, or prolongs at least their life in the match, because the demo one, when we tried to save the Leon from being tunneled, we all ended up dying, except for Ada did get hatched, but... We all ended up dying, but Leon did. We prolonged his life, and he got to play a little bit longer. But unfortunately, it's just been that today. Either tunneling, no camping. Well, I got camped on hook by a legion, but it was the end game. They had nothing else going for them, and they caught me. But my team still got me out and through the exit gate, so I was happy. Oh my god, kill uh, four pallet stuns in a single trial? I was struggling with two! Uh, Alright, when I finished it, I got four gens done using uh, Dark Sense, so I'm happy. I'm happy, but we're gonna go back to our normal place, so. Take this ugly Dark Sense off here, I don't like this perk. Let's go back to this build, let's just do that. I consider myself to be a sweaty killer, but I got morals, like not hitting someone who's just on hook or chasing someone who is unhooking, etc. But the thing about DBD, you can play however you want, even if people don't like it. Exactly! It's like, yeah, I don't agree with how any of these killers have been playing, but at the same time, whatever floats your boat. If you're gonna play it like that, what am I gonna do? I'm gonna go into my next match and have fun with these lovely survivors. And I'm kind of the same way. I kind of consider myself not necessarily a sweaty killer, but I do definitely try my hardest to get a 4k. I really do. But there's a point in the match, though, at the same time where, um, I know it ain't gonna happen, so I will just stop. 
you know, like trying. Like we had a pinhead match. I played pinhead earlier. Didn't go my way. I literally chased a Quinton around a rock for like 10 minutes. Not really 10 minutes, but because there was nothing else to do. Like I knew I wasn't going to get any K uh, kills. So I had fun and I chased the Quinton around a rock. Didn't hit him. Had no intention of hitting him. But I'm also the same. Like I'm not going to... I'm not gonna camp, I'm not gonna tunnel, I'm not gonna... Normally I try not to grab people who are unhooking, I don't like that. I do not like people grabbing me when I'm trying to get an unhook and I try not to do the same. But at the same time, I'm not going to play... You know, like Mojo said, I you got unhooked. I'm gonna go after the next person if you are... I'm not gonna slug either for any kind of kill. You feel that? I mean, yeah. But I am, like, I do like to get my 4Ks. I am going to try my damnedest to get the kills. But I also am not going to try, you know, and play a nasty play style. But if other people like to play it, go for it. It's just not everyone's cup of tea. But it is a game online, so people can play however they want. I go try hard on my Trapper when, I have, when I've had enough, but meantime, I'll be a friendly ghost face. See? And see, I kind of the same, but I always, if it's, even if it's a killer I'm bad at, I still try, like, my hardest, but, like, my pinhead match, I got one hook. <laughs> one hook. And then right at the end, like I said, um, I was going to actually hit the Quentin down, because I was just like, ah, screw it. I'm just going to hit Quentin down, get at least one more hook. But then I realized, I'm like, no, the other three are probably at the door. I'm just going to chase them around a rock. And then after Ace and Michaela came back for him. Bird lady. Nice. When the Michaela and Ace came back for him, I got sad they ruined my fun and I went and hid in a corner. But I was doing it out of fun. Like, I was hiding in a corner because it was fun. I wasn't really, like, butthurt about the match at all. I kind of screwed that Lori over. Sorry. But I'll do that also in matches, even if... Like, I really would like to get more like 4Ks, 3K, even a 2K, but if I realize the match ain't going my way, I will end up turning around and just trying to have fun with the survivors if they're cashing the, you know, that's what I'm doing. Cause also in that pinhead match, the Michaela actually stood with me. It was on this map. Pain resonance, should have guessed. Where did she go? Ah! Holy hell, there she is. Gosh dang it. Okay, I'm running this way. Hopefully someone will get their muffed hook. Nope, okay, I'll run for it. Yeah, I got David. I got it, but I didn't get it. Don't worry, I got this, I got this. No, I'm in here! No, I was gonna hit on stutter! I was gonna hit on stutter! Run, David, run. Why? I was gonna hit on stutter for you to get you free! I don't know if she knew I was in there or if that was pure accident. God, what is everyone's problem? Stop slugging everybody. Uh, 
I didn't hear her coming. My bad. My bad. That was 100% my bad. Sorry. That time I didn't hear her coming. But as I was saying before, I got rudely interrupted by Madam Bird. In my pinhead match, the Michaela stayed behind, and on this map, we stood at the top of the building. And I was trying to get her to go free, but she literally just stood there until she died. As my friend, and I appreciated her so much. Didn't need to do that, though. She did an amazing job in the match, but I thought it was so sweet that she stood on the top balcony with me until her last moment. She even gave me her med kit. That's a tree. I mean, I'll admit I probably deserved that from the bird lady because I one tried blinder, got the blind, but then also did a head on stun because I was afraid Lori was gonna give away my uh thank you. Give away my uh location to where I was. Good call. Good call, Meg. She's like, girl, she's got pain residence. Meg's got it. See, it's become just a day where Jens is not my number one focus. I mean, I got the challenge done with Jens. I'm proud of that. But it's definitely more saving the people like Dave. Oh, I'm not going to get over there with my flashlight in time. Speaking of friendly ghost face, face, I can't wait to get the was up mask and then all my ghost face mask, all my ghost face masks, all my ghost face matches from then on out. They'll always be friendly because I'll just play with that mask. Frick, I forgot she had that perk. When I get off a of gen, I forgot she had that perk. She didn't. Oh my god. Where? Oh, across the map. I'm not gonna be able to get to that one either! Pain Residence canceled it out. That I popped my gen. Oh my god. This is just one of those matches where it's cursed. Mystery! Hey! We got a gen. Oh, we had a gen done. Well, we got another gen done. I wonder if she has like discordance or like call of brain that told her I got back on this gen. I'm gonna tough it out.
not supposed to get out fast, and I did it. Not what I meant to do. That's okay. Hopefully this Meg gets out because she deserves it. She's playing well. It's going to be awesome when you get it. My goal when I get it is to down someone and then shake my head up and down fast like laughing. Oops. A laughing stone ghost face. <laughs> that. I want to do that. Sorry. Sorry, Meg. I didn't mean to miss my skill check. Didn't mean to miss my skill check. I got sidetracked. Nice play. It was the best, wasn't it? <laughs> I did not mean to exit out slowly. I was going to hop in, hop out. And hopefully distract her for like a second. Then I decided, why not slow, slow volt? Why not slow exit, I mean? That's always a good play. Uh, I'm just going to give up on this hook. Hopefully she'll have hatched right near her. Hopefully she'll have hatch right next to her so she'll be able to get hatch. Oh no! See, I think hatch needs to spawn faster. Maybe that's just me. But I hate that you have to wait for pretty much the other character to be absolutely gone from the match. I think it should spawn as soon as my skill checks are gone. It shouldn't have to wait for the whole animation of the entity taking me. And I don't even care as killer if if that's happened. If Hatch spawned right as soon as I'm dead and not having to wait that entire time, that would be really nice. Because right there, what I want to do is I want to not have her save me die on hook but she's already being chased and in hopes that the hatch spawns literally in front of her now i have to wait for my entire animation of me dying all right i've got to heal people so let me bring some med kits i'm not getting through these exit gates um let's give kate one more try The only reason I'm playing here is I'm trying to open an exit gate with her, but I have not been able to get there. I mean, at least I got to gold two today. That's not bad. That's not bad at all, considering how matches are going. Madam Bird there didn't play that bad, actually. She went for the two people who were on death hook, but at the same time, that's okay, I think, in my opinion. I usually play like, I'm going to try and get everybody on one hook and go from there, but if I can't find the damn person, then I usually have to revert and go to someone who's been hooked. So who is excited for the new chapter coming out? Y'all excited for that? I actually on I was thinking about the new chapter on Thursday before I went out and got, went shopping and started my daily chores for the day. I actually got back onto the PTV and I played bot matches to practice my ha my huntress hatchet throws. That was interesting to play. A uh, I always want to call her hatchress, a uh, huntress with bots. It looks interesting. Wondering what the outfits will be now. Same. I really hope that we get a shirtless Vita, Vita Rio. <laughs> I want a shirtless Vita Rio. Actually, I'm kind of anxious to see what the killer would get, too. Oh, I forgot to change my offering. My bad. Bad killers, minions? I was saying, when we played on Wednesday, I was more terrified of those minions than I was the killer himself. Those guards were freaking amazing. 
Because I literally... <laughs> I literally screamed a couple times because the minion guard thing was following me. And I was so focused on him that I ran first, face first into a killer. Or one of those damn guards pulled me out of a locker. I didn't realize that they could do that. Or one of them can do that. I don't know if all three of them can. I think it was the said the assassin can maybe. Clean that drool up. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, we were. That oof. That was a lot of fun. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. I'm just saying. I mean, I posted something in my Discord of a uh, fan-made outfit that I hope TBD sees and makes for us. Hag. The one time I don't bring my flashlight, it's Hag. See if she was over here setting traps. I don't see one on this gen. So let me go here. But, um, what I was going to say about the killer is what I wish that they would change for the killer, and I saw somebody else say this as well. I wish you could choose which guard that you send out on patrol. Because it just cycles through the three, and I'm not positive because I didn't play it enough as killer to see which each guard does, or which one is which, I mean. Like, I, didn't, I couldn't tell you which one was the assassin, which one was the jailer, and which one was um, whatever the third one was called. So I didn't know how to distinguish which one was which and which one did which. So I kind of hope that to make the killer... I don't know if more powerful would be the word, or maybe more fun to me. Frick you. Oh, my finger slipped, my finger slipped, my finger slipped! You're gonna get a free hit because my finger slipped. Free hit because my finger slipped off the controller. Doodles. Back to my gen. I don't think she set a trap. But yeah, that's what I think that needs to happen with the killers. I think they need to make it to where you can cycle through the guards. So, for instance, I'm going to send out the assassin this time instead of the, the other ones. But overall, I think that was fun. I liked all the perks. There was a couple that were like, meh, whatever. Nice. And then I think there was some that's going to be really strong that might get nerfed. Oh, this poor hag. This poor hag just got gen rushed. she set a trap, if I'm being honest. I haven't heard a trap go off. I can't tell if she's setting one right now. Where'd they move the boon to? Over there. which was my split second to throw the pallet. 
I thought she got lost, though. Hey, you set a trap. Thank you. Look at that nice thing. That's a nice looking trap. Oh, so is that one. Oh, one right there, too? Ooh, I got trap camped. I don't think that's camping. I'm just saying. This is actually a very good play right here. Especially against a poor hag who has two hooks and only two gens to go. Wish I could point right now. Like, no oh, traps in front of me. There's three traps. Be careful. Be careful. Uh, 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 Rebecca. There you go. What the hell was that? Did y'all see that? Oh, let's go for the... Let's go for the... Let's go for the slug. Okay, I gotta mend. But did y'all see that? Like, the trap went off, but she didn't actually, like, morph to it. Is that, like, an add-on, or was it a glitch? I don't want to go over there because if she sets, if I set up a trap and I get hits, I put them in a really bad position. Let me just heal myself. Okay, this is better. Now we're healed. Now we can at least set off a trap. And not get absolutely plummeled. I'm coming. Don't worry. I'm a coming. Head on, didn't activate. I, is that? She appears for no fanfare. Yeah! She did there too. Is that an add on? Oh, I was trying to set him off. Well, let's go. Um, Boone. 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 On the other side of the map. Okay, not good. Not good! It's way over here! Yeah, you guys go do that. I'm gonna go heal myself. We'll get out of this. Don't worry. Because I'll admit, I don't know Hags, Hags add-ons at all. Is it like silent trap? Is that what it is? Not silent trap, but silent um like appearance. Oh well, no offense, she's dead. Oh, there's no door over here! Whoops! I swear I saw the door. Oh my god, where the hell are the doors? Well, I guess I'm gonna have to go save. I was gonna try and get a door to 99. Oh, she's gonna open that. No, I did it to open it for my challenge! <laughs> That's why I was trying to find one so fast. Oh, 
Oh, I was gonna heal you, but okay. Okay, she said yes. But, but I don't leave without... But I don't leave without without Rebecca. Ma'am, ma'am, you could shake your head yes at me, but I don't leave without Rebecca. I, I don't I don't leave without Rebecca. Can, can I can I have Rebecca? No. You can take me. I don't leave without Rebecca. She's way over there. See, she was gonna let me go and I appreciate that, but at the same time, no, there was still someone in this match. I had to get them out. I had to get them out. And this is very plausible to do. I'm sorry. I'm not leaving behind my team. I'm not leaving behind my team at all. And then she had to kill it. Well, I don't mind that I died, but then she had to grab her like that. That was rude. That, oh, it's Rusty Shackles. Trigger the plasma trap. Triggered plantasm traps. Give no indication of being triggered to a survivor and do not spawn in mud. Oh, I hate that. Wow, play with your feud. feud? Play with your oop, play with your food is popular today too. Camping POS. I mean, I don't didn't see her really camp any other way, so I ain't gonna say anything. My biggest problem was the grab at the end. I didn't notice her camping any other time though. In the end game like that, the camp at the end like that, I actually don't mind. There's nothing else for her to do. I mean, she yeah, she could go off and find somebody else for sure. And placing the traps around someone, I don't consider that camping at all. I don't consider um, hag or who else can do something like that. Is that it? Well, I don't consider that camping. All right, what do we got here? What do we got? Oh, hook five people in the basement while using agitation. I'm gonna attempt to stun a killer four times, I guess. That's kind of hard for me too, was hard enough, but it's okay. Oh, I said I was gonna give Kate one more try and I didn't get it. I was hoping that Kate would have got off the... <laughs> I was really hoping that Kate would have got off of the um, door there to heal. And then I was gonna slightly open the door real quick. <laughs> but she did it. Cause I just needed to open the door as Kate. And if I don't get it this time, I'm going to switch up my survivor. We just played a lot of Kate recently. Let's do a Sabo. Oops, I got two speeds. Sorry, I don't want this one. I want this one. So it's Rusty Shackles does that. I did not know that. I didn't know that the hag had a add-on that did that. But I won't judge her. She, I thought, played a pretty fair game. I mean, benefit of the doubt. She was down to two gens, I think it was, with barely any hooks. For her to pull out a 4K like that, good for her. I don't... She was going to let me leave, but... It's okay. My teammates were still in the match, so I was good. 
But I do feel bad that the um, Rebecca did end up losing or dying. Voorhees! Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. Good luck on the Jill on the team. Oh, good luck. Have fun. None of the killer are already finding me. Frick you. Frick you. Missed me. <laughs> okay, he's stalking at the moment. Didn't think he saw me go in there. Basemented for my sins? Why? That was a really not good play, but could have been worse. It's a ghosty. It is a ghosty. Of course he found me first. I seem to always find the killer first. <laughs> I don't know what it is about me sometimes, but I will find the killer first. He could have lethal. He very easily could have lethal, so that's probably maybe why he found me, but... <gasps> Let's go! Alright, I'm gonna go way over here. Keep my eye out for ghosty here. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> I'm sorry. I love how being caught it. We're just like, and. Are you going to see us here healing? Sorry, I had a skill check. <laughs> Soothing's kink. I like your name. Thank you. Oh, bless and a totem. I love it. Let's see what she's got. Just circle of healing. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. Circle of healing way over here. I should be looking a little closer to my surroundings. Sorry. Alright. Okay. There he is. Damn! Nice running. Oh, well. I was gonna sabo that hook. Oh, no? Oh, come on! You 
go fine. I was gonna head on stun you. this match I thought this was another one that the um, Nia did not commit to that chase at all. I'll admit, I actually don't know where a gen is. Oh, I see some. Alright, this is a very exposed gen, though. I don't know where another hook is, but I'm going to take out this one. he comes back this way. Let's go. Whoever got that last one, noise. Not the no way! Here, let me open this door. It's faster. Booning? So they might know where totems are. Oh, I think someone found it. Wait, no, is that it over there? No, that's a boon. Let's go! apologize also for opening that door. I needed it for a challenge. I will like totally die. 
Uh, for that door being opened. I'm gonna heal up. No, don't give up! Whoever's on hook, don't give up! We're coming! I'm just trying to get healed so we don't get two people down. Let's go. I'll protect you. You're on death hook. I'll protect you. Nia? No, Nia! Okay, we got this. We got this. Both doors are opened. Oh, that was her death hook? Sorry, that was her death hook. I thought she had a hook to spare. Oh, she gave up on hook. See, that is why you don't give up on hook. I made my way across the map to save you and you had just given up on hook. Where did you, oh, there you are. Hi. I think he's coming. I think he's coming. Come on, ghosty. Come on. Come on. Come on, ghosty. Come on. There you are. Come on. I was going to let him get a little extra hit on me. Uh, but see? If she wouldn't have given up on hook, I could have got her off the hook, possibly. The door was open. And I would have body blocked for her, but that's okay. Some people just, they're gonna try to get that 4%. I get it, I got my challenge done finally, thank goodness. Ghosty was playing with Thrilling Tremors, Predator. You know what, I think they played a good game. I will say it, GGWP. Thrilling Tremors, Predator, No Wed, and Spies. Playing with Ghostface caught on tape and then also the driver's license. No GG's back? Okay, no GG's back. GGWP to you as well! I did not- I'm sorry, I didn't mean to run away from the Exegate. I thought that Nia had another hook to spare. I was gonna go help her out, but then when she died, I was like, oh, never mind. <laughs> never mind, she's dead. But, um, I think what what caught me off guard was she like, was trying to get off the hook, um, for stage when we were trying to get there, and she went to second stage, and I didn't notice. So that's what that's why I didn't notice, but I was gonna try. But GG's, it was a fun match. I thought Ghostface played well. Compared to the matches I'm getting today, I think they played really well. So no complaints there. Alright, I'm gonna spin for my next survivor since we finally uh, That's the only reason I opened that gate so soon is because I had a daily ritual for that. Let's get this play one. I'm not really playing killer. Oh, uh, wait. No, I'm just not really feeling the killer today again. It's just not a killer style day for me. I'm kind of having more fun playing Survivor today. Whoopsie, wrong button. Trying to get my roller up. Alright. Yeah, I don't know why she gave uh, me and Quad were right next to her, and I was very close. I was in the boot. I was watching her try and get off the hook while I was healing, and I think I even screamed, don't give up, we'll be right there, because I could see your guys' aura. I just wanted to get healed because I didn't want to have to put another person on the ground to make it harder for you and the Claudette to try and get both her off the hook and me up. So I was in the boon healing and watching, and I just didn't realize that she had actually gone to second stage. I thought maybe she had a life left and I wasn't paying attention. But I don't know why she gave up. We were all right there. I just wasn't in a hurry because I needed to get healed first. So I wasn't putting us in a worse situation. Because I've done that before. Being injured, go for the save. Then all of a sudden you got someone on a hook, someone on the ground. And it's like, oh no, I've just made hell for my team to try and get now two people up and out. But 
it is what it is, you know? It happens. It happens. Games go like that. Sometimes people do that. Uh, why? I don't know, but... Steve! We're gonna go play some Steve! Uh, okay, we could do that. It's been a little while since we've played Steve. I don't mind playing Steve at all. I keep getting those same survivors, though. I swear, my, my roller be broke. Mi roller be broke. But we will play C for a little while. Um, not blood, but I don't know what's my points. Ooh! No, 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 no. This is my normal build. I was gonna say, the last time I played C, it was since I have my new build, but now this is it. Yes, it was a good game, though. Yeah, it was actually a really good game. I've, I've had some interesting games today, for sure. Meeting, like, uh, slugs. Lots of camping, lots of tunneling and things like that. I thought that ghost face actually played really well. It looks like they were possibly a little bit newer as well because they had all level one perks and stuff, but that's not always a telltale sign. That's definitely not always a telltale sign. Because I play killer quite a bit and I don't have any perks unlocked because I put all my points into my survivors. Steve's going to need some because he's running out of stuff. He's running out of stuff. I guess I'll just put this in. Um. Yeah, I'll keep my resilience on. I was gonna change it up and maybe put on like inner healing to heal myself. But nah, nah, nah. We'll do some. We'll keep our normal build. <clears throat> Before he's, I had a blast with you in that match. You were an awesome survivor. I hope you're having a good day in the fog and that everything is going well for you. It's like the been interesting on my end over here. Oh, sure. I've been stuck at Eerie 2 all day due to camping and tunneling. I got tunneled out this morning at five. Oh no, five gens by a dredge. It's just, it's, it's been very, very spicy is what I like to say. I've been lucky enough to go up from well I started the day at gold four with one pip to go so I got that pip and I've been able to go through all three but I'm stuck on two now but it's because it, it's been like that it's I had a Sadako who pretty much was trying to slug uh, she did slug but we were able to actually get everybody up and only one person died, I think. Did I die? I can't remember if I died or not, but no, I think I got out. No, I, no, I bled out. That's what happened. She was so focused on slugging everybody that I bled out. Um, so I died, but she didn't get the kill. Um, we had that happen. Um, there was another match where... I wasn't being tunneled, but a Leon was, and the whole team was trying to not have this demo of uh, tunneling them. We all ended up- no, we didn't all end up dying. Bill ended up bleeding out too. And then the Ada got hatch. We prolonged our lives in that match, but yeah, we didn't really uh, survive. We didn't get all gens done though. But it'd be one of them days, you know? It be one of them days. Did I say thank you for the follow, Voorhees? I think I did. But thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. I think I said it. All right. Oh, I didn't change my charms. Good luck. Have fun. I got my Halloween charms on. Okay, there should be a gen in here because this light's blinking. Nurse! Hmm. Okay. We'll see. Did you put your dino mask back up? Let's go! How are you feeling, Brad? Are you feeling better? I'm sorry, I saw you come back and I got sidetracked. Are you feeling better?
Frick you. Oh, I got stuck on the- <laughs> Got stuck on the wall. Oh, nice one. Nice one. See? Go for the Dwight. Don't go for the slug. Go get Dwight. Okay, I have resilience. So I'm going to keep uh, oh, I'm being injured. Just keep on being injured. Yeah, it's one of those days, but I started this game five months ago. And I'm a killer main, but I wanted to hit Eerie 1 on Survivor because I've never done it yet. Nice! Well, I hope you get there. I'm a Survivor main, and I've been playing for about a year. Pushing 2, it would be April of next year. It would be two years. But maining it... Maining it and putting more of my hours since last December. And I've never hit Eerie 1. But I also have never really pushed to make Eerie 1 either. I kind of going to see if I can like naturally let it happen kind of thing. Because I normally only play on stream. There are times I play offline, but when I play offline, I am usually playing killer. Because I enjoy playing killer too. And I normally play killer on stream, but there are just some days you ain't feeling it. So I'm not going to play killer today because I wasn't feeling it earlier. Can I ask what... Uh, you said you're a killer main. Do you have a specific killer you like playing? Or do you play them all? Or like a specific... Like me, I like teleporting gens... Uh, gens. Teleporting killers a lot. I'm just gonna do this. I'm gonna keep being on injured. I'm okay. I took a little rest on my side and it chilled my belly. Okay, good. I'm glad you're feeling better. Never mind, I thought I saw something, but I don't think I did. Thought I saw something happen to that window when I vaulted it, but I can't honestly. She could have crowd control, but I'm not positive on that. I looked back because I thought I heard the the window be blocked. Oh, never mind. I got off the gen thinking it was going to be a scourge hook, but no, it's not. I don't think she's got a scourge hook. Our dredge was DC'd after three gens done. What? Why? Come on, just tough it out. That's one thing I haven't had happen today. I haven't had a DC today. I'm going to jinx it and probably get a TUD now, but... I played a killer match today. I got freaking one hook. And I stayed in my match. Because I don't believe in DCing. And I had this sweet Michaela stay with me until the end. She said she didn't want to leave. She was going to stand by my side the whole time. And she did. She died with me on the top. Well, not with me. Oh my god, what is going on? What are y'all you, doing down there? I mean, I wouldn't put it past this nurse to slug now because... Or slug or... Okay, I'll be back for you, Michaela. I'm gonna make a run over there to her. That way I can get her off safe.
got you, I got you, I got you. Oh, damn. Oh, what? What? What's, what's, what's Claude doing over there? What's Claude doing over there? I thought she was across the map. I wasn't really paying attention. She didn't come this way. See, now she kind of tunneled that, that Claude out of the match because she was on death hook, but at the same time, she only had one hook. I'm gonna stun a nurse. That'd be fun. I'm gonna wait for her to get lost. Go back to that gen. Wait, where was that gen? It was right here, wasn't it? Oh my god, where the hell is that gen? Ah, screw it. I'm using my medkit. I got lost. I don't know where I am. Uh, but I mean Doc and Legion. I love pressure killers, and I've got at least everyone P1 other than Trickster, Nurse, Pyramid Head, Dredge, Blight, and Oni. Nice! See, I like teleporting killers. Oh, let's go. Um, Dredge is one of my favorites. Freddy is kind of one of my favorites only. What is it with the Noah today? What is it with this Noah? See if I can find it. I don't know where it would be. To put on a totem build because there's so many noed players out there. Oh, that's a door. I hope Dwight's going for her. Damn, Dwight didn't go for her. It was her or the totem and sadly I picked the totem. I will not leave Dwight behind, though. D Run, Dwight! Leave, Dwight! <sighs> not gonna have enough time to get to the door. Remember where the door is, but I'm gonna make a run for it. All right, me and you, nurse. Me and you, nurse. Come on. Come on, you want you want to do it. No, Dwight! Oh, now she's gonna go for the slug. I don't blame her for going to the slug here. Ah! 
I forgot my head on was gone. I had that. No. I forgot my head on was gone, and then when I realized it, I tried to get to the pallet. I'm sorry, Dwight. That was 100% my bad. GG's, nurse. GG's. I'm so mad at myself. You don't have to act like an asshole about it, though, nurse. <laughs> it was my bad. I forgot. Wow, she's mad that I tried to save my team. I forgot my head on was gone. I, I'm giving her credit. She deserves this. I don't deserve being hit on hook, but... I deserve this, like, stare down, though, because that was my bad. I got your notes still though, so huh. Anyways, as I was saying before I had to concentrate, I like playing um, teleporting killers, but I do really love playing Doc. The Doctor is a lot of fun to play, I think. The Doctor is a lot of fun to play. I, I main dredge. I wanna see if they say anything. Fana, Noed, a nurses. I mean, GGWP. I will give that nurse all the credit. I freaking stunk, uh, stunk that last bit up because I thought I had no ed left and I didn't. Oh, come on, killer. Say GG's. All right, they're just, they're not very nice in general. And I have Legion and Doc at P4 and Musker at P3 and a couple others at P2 other than all P1. I have nobody at P2? I think I have everybody at P1, but I am a survivor main. So I usually like stick all my points into my survivors. Let me go over here. Yeah, I finally got all my killers to P1. And then they've got a little bit of put uh, points put into them because I was trying to find all of the Halloween stuff for them. But, oh no, my artist is P3. Uh, I forgot. She's my only P3 killer because she was my main when she first came out. And she's the reason I like playing killer. So she does have P3, but everybody else is P1. But I like playing a lot of killers. Pinhead's fun. The artist is fun. Wesker was kind of fun. Dredge is my love. Nemesis, I've enjoyed playing right recently. Clown's kind of fun. Doctor. I have a lot of favorites, so I don't really have um, one person specifically, but Dredge would probably be my number one. You survived! No gas for you. <laughs> GG's. I, like I said, it was completely my bad. I thought I had head on, and as soon as I exited that locker and she didn't get stunned, my brain went into panic mode to hit that pallet. And I wasn't going to get it because she hit me. I thought the nurse played an actually a good game. And then for her to act like that at the end, I was like, come on now. You did good. You cannot fault me for what I did. That is just what you do as Survivor. You try and save your teammates. I wasn't going to give up. And I wasn't going to like lay down and let you kill me. I think when I see a killer don't say GG like that at the end, I think they just are full of themselves and think that they're really good when they did a pretty good job, yes. Would I think they're the best nurse? No, not really. I've seen much better nurses. I need to put some points into Steve, I think, though. He's running out of, like, little stuff. So I'm gonna put a little bit of points into him. Nice. Dredge is fun, too. I need to get his perks. He's a lot of fun. He is definitely the number one killer I go to and play. Because I love the teleporting. I love... 
the darkness aspect of the of his power and everything and then um Overall, he's just fun. Like, I love playing against stretches, too. I just rarely see them. Uh, my other favorite, though, to play is probably Freddy, but it has to be Dream Palette. I will not play Freddy if I don't have Dream Palettes, because uh, I don't think he's that fun. That much fun if he doesn't have that. Let's just get rid of our bound stuff. I didn't really get anything I wanted, but that's okay. Oh, I'm supposed to stun the killer four times in a match. Yeah, right. We'll try, but yeah, right. Today, though, I'm not really going to play much killer. It It's kind of a mood thing for me. And we played one match earlier as Pinhead. And it didn't go bad. Oh, well, yes, it did. I had one lousy hook. But <laughs> I thought the game itself went really well. I just was not getting the hooks. And I was putting my focus in the wrong spots. But I like playing Pinhead as well lately. So just one of them days that didn't go well. Maybe after this match, we'll go play. I don't really feel like playing any of them. Maybe Sadako. We've got Clown and Wraith, but not really in the mood to play either of them. Hi, Taser. You're late today. It's 5.30. Oh, by the way, if you guys are in the United States and you set your clocks back, if you have clocks that don't do it automatically, <laughs> don't forget to. Today, daylight saving times ends. Which everything... No, I have a clock in my room that's a wind-up clock because it's like an old-fashioned one that I love. I love it. It's like vintage-looking. But... If you do have anything that needs changed, don't forget, that's today. Most of my stuff, though, is automatic. My phone, my computer, things like that. But I do have, like, a vintage clock in my room that I need to wind backwards. And then an extra hour of sleep! I'm so excited. But also, at the same point, um, I will probably just stay up late, and I will either watch more Riverdale tonight or Hamilton again. <laughs> I'm serious. I really love the Hamilton. SK made me watch. Well, she didn't make me, but I really love our friendship and I wanted to talk to her some more. So I had to watch it and I regret not watching it earlier. I regret not watching it earlier because it was really good. God, Leary's again? I have not had a good variety of maps today. I'm either on Leary's or, uh, good luck. Ormond. I've played Ormond so many times today. And also had people bring offerings for it. So. Let's see if this is better than my toolbox. Hmm. A little low one. I'll take. Oh, I was going to let you go through the door. I don't run. Should we whisper? Oh, there's a jet. Let's go. <laughs> it's gotta be a stealth killer or a trapper, because I haven't heard them yet. Then instead of talking to you, I took a two hour nap. This guy, no! Oh, I'm glad you got it out. <laughs> she wasn't talking to me. That's just napped. Nah, I'm kidding. I'm glad you got a two hour nap in SK. Hamilton was okay at best to me. I freaking loved it. 
I was telling SK earlier that I will totally watch it again in very, very soon. Uh, if it wasn't 2 a.m. If it wasn't 2 a.m. and I didn't have to stream today, well, I didn't have to stream today, but I wanted to stream today, I probably would have just turned it back on and replayed it. But I said, no, 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 I gotta sleep. I gotta get some rest tomorrow's stream. So I turned it off like a good girl. But I really enjoyed it. I thought it was really good. I thought what was interesting is I didn't realize it wasn't an actual movie, that it was the stage production of it. And I thought that was really cool. I thought for the longest time it was just a movie based around the stage performance like they usually are. But it isn't for everybody, I totally understand, because also I don't like Sweeney Todd and I know there's a couple people in my chat who love it. But I don't. I tried watching it and I didn't like it at all. That one wasn't my cup of tea. I think it was a demo I heard, but I don't know where they are. I thought I heard him yell. All right, skill check. Every time, every time someone wants to heal me or I want to get off Jen, skill check. Okay, if you want another Broadway show by Lynn, watch The Heights. It was turned into a movie. It's based on the neighborhood he grew up in, in NYC. I saw something about that last night when I was reading through uh, his Wikipedia, because I was trying to find something last night that I thought he had did, but he didn't, I guess, according to his Wikipedia. And I saw that and made me want to watch it. Poor demo. Michaela almost the whole match. Antonio Ramos was in Hamilton. He was all oh, he was Lawrence and Phyllis. Uh, Phyllis. Phyllis. Philip Hamilton plays the main role. Oh, okay. Do you know if it's anywhere online right now? Trying to find the Rebecca's. Not a spicy though. Wonder if it's Noah. Let me check. I know it was HBO. Okay, yeah. If you could let me know, I will definitely check that out. I do got HBO.
Okay, this door was open. I don't know where Michaela is, but I took out a totem! Michaela's just booting. <laughs> She'll probably get to a door, but I'll wait just in case something happens. Well, even if she gets caught, I don't think I'll be able to go catch her before I die, so... I'll leave! I think she's probably at the other door. Let me see if that was Noed that I cleansed, or if they had another hex. Nope, it was Noed. I got Noed! Well, that's at the end! Poor Demo. Poor Demo. I wanna know, though, why... Why have I been getting paired all day and, like, the last week with what seems like brand new people to the game when it comes to Killer? Because I don't mind it, but I also feel really bad for these Killers where I've got over 800 hours in the game. I'm not that good, but I definitely know how to outrun a Killer who's pretty new. Because poor Demo didn't even get a hook. He only got one hit, and that was on me. Oh, no! My tummy told me no sleep yet! I think it's upset over dinner, which sadly contained, oh, a lot of oil. Oh, Denny, I'm sorry. Your tummy said no. Not good. It is on HBO Max. Nice. I'm going to see if I can watch that tonight. I mean, I want to watch Hamilton, but I might try and watch that. <laughs> I hope your tummy gets better. What did you eat? For dinner, Denny. I know you said it contained a lot of oil, but what'd you eat? Everybody's been having tummy issues. Uh. Oh, excuse me. Actually, I'm gonna have to get up here in a minute and close my window because it's getting dark outside. It's gonna be super dark tomorrow at this time, though. If I'm being honest, I didn't even realize the Halloween event was over. <laughs> I know it ended on, what, Wednesday? Thursday? Thursday, I think. Thursday morning. And I kind of miss, like, the pumpkins. Like, I miss the kicks of the pumpkins and, like, the decorations. But I actually don't miss the event that it's over. I don't have any tummy issues, but I have a booty issue after eating- Oh, eating an Italian sub with hot pepper relish on it last night? I know that problem, you yeah. Yep. See, I had a tummy problem last night, too. Uh, like, I was in sleeping last night, and I got, like, this massive stomach ache, and I had to get up and go to the bathroom. And it kind of helped. I went back and laid down. It was still there, but it went away eventually. But I had some tummy issues last night from what? I don't know. I only have potatoes because potatoes, you know, I cut them in new moon pieces into a pan and put in the oven with, oh... With, um, oil, yeah. Oh, and added rock salt. Ooh. Potatoes in my tummy don't usually get along well. That sucks because potatoes are so good. <laughs> I love potatoes. Hey! A map that is not Ormond or Leary's. I love me some Leary's, but I want to go somewhere else. I keep running change my charms, that's okay. Oh, my guess is it's got corrupt because he came running out of here. 
Oh, it doesn't. Okay. I thought it had corrupt because he came running out of this room. Hopefully it's not a sneaky killer coming reading chat. Things that are going to cause tummy and booty problems should not taste so damn good. I know, right? That's just rude. Is it hag again? Yeah. Ooh, I feel like this hag's gonna be a little bit harder to play against. I heard her setting traps, I thought. That's what made me double think about what I wanted to do there. Only potatoes, really? Not fries, more powdered mashed potatoes? Well, that's weird. I wonder if it's like, well, I could see the powdered mashed potatoes because maybe it doesn't have enough potato, you know what I mean, in it. Fries? Well, I mean, I guess it maybe depends on how the fries are made, like the actual fries, not how you make them. The only thing is I feel sick and my tummy is being mean. Mean tummy suck! I know! Everybody's got a mean tummy today! Yeah, I couldn't run away fast enough. I thought we'd be able to finish that. Tis be okay! Yes, I hope everyone feels better. Everybody who has a tummy issue today or... Another issue? <laughs> Y'all, I hope you get better very soon. Like I said, I had one last night, so I know. Hi there! Y'all making me hungry for potatoes? That does sound really good, right? I mean, I know it caused Denny some issues, but I could definitely eat all the potatoes for Denny. <sighs> Toodles. Fang! Oh my god, what are you still doing here? Ah. Frick you. Ah. I was more scared about Fang getting caught that I ran into her than anything else. Ah. Yeah, I hope all with me tummies feel better soon. Yes. That's actually a good placement right there where she put that. That was actually a really good one. <laughs> Sorry for making you want potatoes in these dire times. <laughs> I know! I was just gonna say, we're all like, we want potatoes now. And poor Daddy's over here like, no, no potatoes. <laughs> Finally hit P... Oh, I thought Leon was the killer. Finally hit P2 on Jill. Nice. I'm a Quentin main though for Survivor and have him at... Him at P7? Nice. I'm a Michaela main usually, and I think she's my P7 as well. Ooh, she's got Huntress. Okay, I'm not gonna jump out of that window, though, because she's got a trap there. Leon set it off, but that's okay. Oh, but she didn't come! Okay. She's busy with Kate. Oh, you got pizza? Oh, that sounds so good. I love pizza. Pizza and fries are like my two guilty foods. Scarlet be like, I can't deal with you right now. Toodles! And all I see is Cheryl. Oh no. And all I see is Cheryl Blossom. I love that though. My God. 
Oh my god, the bush technique is working! Kate's in the corner over there and I don't want her to know that she's over there, so I'm trying to not move. Oh my god, I cannot believe this Kate and I just survived that. Bush technique wins! It always wins! No, not really, but... Steve was a bush. There you go. Congratulations on that sneaky thing there. That sneaky play. Oh, fuck! <laughs> Sorry, I didn't realize she trapped that, too. Oh, she's covered, though. I did not realize she trapped that. I saw her trap the window over there. Okay, I'm good, I'm good. I may need and have her at P13. As I was saying, I mean, if I main anyone, it's Michaela, and she's, I think, at P7. But my Claudette? Mm -hmm. Oh, I can't go that way. That's okay. That's okay. I couldn't do anything, so. I got myself trapped in a corner. If I didn't realize there was no vault there, I probably could have hidden a locker from her. I'm bringing the team down! Ankle's absolutely broken, right? She, I can't, I still can't believe I got away with that. Oh my god, you really had to hit her on hook twice? See, this is what I mean. People just be playing nasty today. Actually, oh, I was going to give up, but all right, I'm not going to do my last skill check. People just be playing nasty like that today. Like, she didn't really need to hit that poor girl twice. She must have a... Um... What is that perk called? The one where you can hit uh, no cooldown. Or it's not no cooldown, but really um, slow cooldown. Push techniques work. I just want to see if she's playing with the park. Um, but anyways, um, I'm being done right now. Both we'll Cheryl Mason halfway... Uh, but Cheryl Mason halfway. She's P13. Eugene is P13. Jill is P13. David is P12. And Jonah is P12. As well as Hattie. Damn! And now I just want to spoil... Same! I think most of my points from now on out are gonna go into Vita Rio. For sure. Because I think my highest is Michaela. But I think Claudette's either a 5 or 6. And then after that, I think everybody's P3. But I might have a couple P4 somewhere. This hag did not deserve this. She played nasty to get both. She played absolutely nasty to get this. I want to see what perk she's running with. If she's got the perk, I think. Mad Grit! That's the perk I'm thinking of. I think she's got Mad Grit. 
Cause she was able to hit that poor either Fag or Kate. I don't know which one was trying to save me. Really fast after she hit her originally. Lightborn for one flashlight. Save the best for last. Oh, she did it. How did she hit her so fast? How? That cooldown should have given that poor girl enough time to save me. But she had Pentimento, Lullaby, Save the Best for Last is really popular today, and then, um, Lightborn. Alright, alright! If y'all gotta resort to playing nasty like that to get some points. Go for it, I guess. I don't know. Let's see, what do I got here? Oh, I got more P4s than I thought. So my Dwight and my Claudette are P5. And then, and then yeah, my Michaela's a P7, almost a P8. And then after that, either everyone's four or three, except for Ada and Rebecca, who I need to um, try and get up there and just get their perks unlocked for everybody. And I'd like to do that before the next chapter comes out because as soon as, like, the week before the chapter comes out for Forged and Fog, I'll be saving my 1 million BP for, or no, excuse me, 2 million BP now. My 2 million BP for, um, both Vita Rio and the Night Killer, because I like to get them to at least P1. And we'll just stick with this. And then after that, I will try to get them to P2 and 3 to get their tiers 2 and 3 unlocked. But it's not as important as at least getting their first level unlocked to me. Alright, while we load into this match, I'm just going to get up. I'm not going to put my b rag back screen on. I'm just going to let this play out. And then I'm just going to go close my window because it's getting cold in my room. So I will be right back. All right, I'm back. My neighbors across the street have put up their Christmas lights. I was closing my window because it's getting cold and dark. And across the street, they've got some Christmas lights up on their house already. No. No, it's November 5th. Not yet. I will accept that at the first, uh, the week of Thanksgiving. <laughs> Christmas house lights, week of Thanksgiving. But no. Not yet. It totally looks like, um, they tried to shoot you in your penis. Thank you, Brad, for giving SK a shout out. Is that an error, or are you happy to see me? Someone gonna DC? Or someone have a really bad lag because it's taking a really long time to load into this match? Usually that means someone's gonna DC or. Somebody's got a really bad ping loading in. All right, can't promise I'll do better this match, but. Because that, this match, I just keep going to the old, the old loops. 
That's how I got, kept getting caught the last time we played on this map, is I kept trying to go through a doorway that was no longer there. Oh, damn. feeling they have a bad pig. I have a feeling they had a bad pig because it took us a really long... Oops, that's not what I wanted. It took us a really long time to load into that game. Yeah. Oh no, he definitely lost connection. He was pl actively playing. She has her good and bad days. One time my power went out when I was on a gen. My sister was playing with me and she said I was suddenly disappeared in the gen and then the gen. Oof. Do you think they just had a internet connection issue? Predator, Iron Grasp, Shadowborn, Jolt, and like I said, it took us forever to log into that match or load into that match that I figured that was coming. Either that or I was gonna have a really, really, really bad ping. Like it was gonna be like he grabbed you from far away or hit you from far away or something like that. But GG's to all the other teammates. Um, do you keep your stuff? Yeah. If you get DC'd. Man, I'm stuck at gold two, though. I don't think I'm going to get up to gold one. I still count on my DC counter, but at the same time, it wasn't their fault. I really do think. Power outage, internet connect uh, connection, something like that. I'm glad, though, that I don't have to play up against them, because they embarrassed myself doing that head-on, and they didn't, um, get stunned or see me. I, they might have seen me, but did not work like I wanted it to work, so that was embarrassing. Hello! Welcome on in! Thank you so much for the follow! 
And uh, GG's last match. <laughs> GG's. Yeah, I had a feeling that was... Well, I should say I had a feeling that was coming. I thought that... Um, I thought we were going to actually lose connection loading into the match. Because... Sometimes, like, when, like, right now, if you're loading in and it takes too long... Usually that's because someone has DC'd or has a bad connection. We killed it! We did! We did! That was the- that honestly, and I'm being this- I'm meaning this as serious. That was like the best match of the day. <laughs> I've had some rough matches today, so that was a good one. I liked that one. But it sucks that happened, but I really think, yeah, I think you're right. They had an internet- it, it had an internet issue, could have been a power outage, could have been a lot of things, but I don't think they DC'd on their own. Not at all. And I was just saying, I don't know if you were here when I said it, but I was like, I'm kind of glad they DC'd because I messed up a head-on stun because I thought that they were running by the locker because they were Wraith. And I was like, I got this, I got this. And I totally flew out of the locker and they weren't there. So I was embarrassed. <laughs> so I'm glad that they weren't, weren't around anymore to see me embarrass myself more. <laughs> Oof, right? I know I do too. Uh, I hate messing up head on. And I do it quite often. I will never ever say I'm good at head on, but I love the perk because it's fun. But, um, yeah, I really thought he was going to come my way because I saw his kind of shadow. Because he was chasing Lori. So I flew out of the locker and he wasn't there. But that's okay. He DC'd and made my embarrassment so much nicer. <laughs> I wonder if it's Wraith again. Nah, nah, I think it's a stealth killer. But I will never, like I said, I'll never say I'm good at head on. There's been plenty of times I totally, totally messed it up. Couple matches ago, I was trying to save a Dwight at the end game. Because the killer walked by my locker and um, I had already used it, so I was still exhausted. So I flew out in front of him while injured and ended up going down. And then the nurse got very cocky about it happening, but it was 100% my bad. I thought I still had it, but I had used it like maybe a second or so ago. Well, not a second, but I was still exhausted. Oh, somebody's got her. Okay, well, I'll go back to my gen. going down, but I'm not going over to kill our shack because I think he... Mine have way. trapped it. Thank you so much for the work! I'll be lurking, but it was nice to meet you. It was nice to meet you, too! Whoopsie! I think they're newer to kill her too. Oh, well, I'm here. But good luck, have fun in the rest of your matches as well. Uh, I hope your games are going good. Like I said, mine have been kind of up and down. Okay, I'm not gonna get rid of that totem since there is someone with the boot.
I don't know if I should be doing this, Jen. Reason being is I know that Jen's done. The one over there is very close to being done and it could really start a three gen. So I might try and get this done as not bad. Alright, you put a trap there. That sounds good. You stop it to do that works too. Thought he had one there. He's got one here. Here's one. Think he's got the perk that injures me? Nope. There might have been one at the corner, but I don't think so. This feels like a trapper who probably puts them in the obvious spots of doorways, right at vaults, right at pallets and I'm not paying attention and I pop my jet that's okay I got her real quick. I'm just gonna stick here on this shine. Because it makes me think, I think one of the, I think it's probably Veda has fire taps so that Jen has been worked on. Oh, okay. I don't want to do that, Jen, because I'm pretty sure this one up here is probably almost done. Get that done and then possibly go help her. Not possibly, go help her. Wait, is he up? Never mind. I thought I had fear monger, I just couldn't see her. Guaranteed he's going after Ada right now. Oh, no, he's not. Oh, frick fang. Hi. He's going after Yui. Let's go. boon so Ada could have run over to that we'll get this door 99 see if we hear the other door open and then see if we can go help Huey has looks like dead hard think there's any traps through here Doesn't look like it. All right, where was the other door? No trap. Try and run where I know there's no traps. It's okay, it's okay, we got this.
I am completely lost. I don't know where the other door is. I thought it was over here and it's not. Oh, the deliverance! Let's go! Let me go try and help her. He's got to have light born. Oh, it's over by this boon, damn it. Congratulations, you got one because I was trying to stop dead in my tracks. I was trying to stop dead in my tracks when I saw it, and then it was too late. Oh, thanks for leaving me behind! I appreciate you guys! Why are killers so salty today? I keep getting killers who are like, I did one good thing on you, and I'm gonna hit you now on a hook because I am the best trapper there is. That is the vibe they give. But thank you to my teammates for leaving me behind on hook. I also appreciate them. I appreciate them a lot. I have cheese! Since it's slice and provolo, not nacho. It is no cheese lube. What's the point? What's the point then? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Ah, oh, that sounds good. I'm getting hungry. We all talk about food up in chat. Denny did. He did. Uh, he said it was spicy today, and I said I will wait and see what happens when I get in the fog, and now he is right. He is so right. I've had all good survivors today, though. I can't really complain about them. That last one, there was two people right there at the door. They could have done something to help, but they said, nah, screw you. That was my bad. I will admit, that was not, that was not like a good trap or pl uh, play in my opinion. It was my bad. I saw that trap there and I still kept running. But I've had a lot of killers today be like that. They'd be like, I'm so good. I got one person killed and one person stuck in my trap. Now I'm going to sit here and hit you on hook because I did the best. You're 50 50 with us. You got two kills with two escapes. Not your best of games, in my opinion. But, it is what it is. We will move on and play probably one more match. Hi, SK's mom. I have to get farther in my rift, so today was so bad. I have barely went up in my rift today, but I haven't, um... I haven't got any challenges left for fr rift fragments, so I'm not getting the extra there. I'm only at 47. I think I've only gone up one level today. It moves! You can see the move. It's moving. I got this one. The It's like the entity, we think, but um, charm that moves. Yeah, we'll run with those charms. I kept having my Halloween ones on. How are you today, SK's mom? You doing good? But I swear, every killer I keep getting, they're like, they're either new to the game or they're just nasty players. It's been all day. Hi, Taser. No, lay down. Stop. Just lay down. Oh, scratch it under the chair. Yeah. All right, there you go. Want to say hi? Snip my mic? No? Okay. Well, Taser says hi. 
You gonna take more of a nap? Okay. Oh, okay, but a little depressed. I'm sorry. One of them days. Yes, Brad, thank you so much for giving SK's mom a, sh uh, a hug. I was gonna say a shout out, a hug. Brad says hi, ta ta Ugh, Taser and Maddie. Uh, I was gonna say Tazer. They're both sleeping in my bed. It's cold. They want to uh, curl up in bed. Maddie was being a pain earlier, but she finally laid down and took a nap. Taser's now trying to make a comfy spot, so he's clawing at my bed, which I want him to not do. You uncovered Maddie, Taser! I had her all covered up! <laughs> no, just lay down. Oh my god, we're at Ormond again. I love Ormond, don't get me wrong, but it's been the map of the day. This could be my last match if it doesn't go super fast. And not once today did we get a corn map. I feel like that's a map I get at least once a stream. Another ghost face. Great. Great! I really don't like playing against Ghostface players. Oh, yeah, today a very good friend buried her grandson. Oh, was that today? I know SK was saying something about it was coming up. I didn't realize that was today. I'm so sorry. I know that's rough. That is definitely rough. No corn shield? How dare they not send you there today, right? No, not once. This is the map I've got the most today. And then we got a maid giving up on hook. Maybe not. Maybe she's just doing the motion. Wait, no, it's not a Meg. Sorry. The Meg wasn't caught. The Meg is still currently... Running! Michaela! Michaela, no! Look what you've done! Look what you've done! I'm not healing you. <laughs> I'm going over here. If you want heals, Michaela, you can find me. Is he following? Ghostface can be fun. I agree. Ghostface can be fun. I haven't found a fun one, though, in quite a while. She's not even trying, so she can die. <laughs> Go back to this gen. But what what I hate about Ghostface as well is he's the scariest killer to me. I have more jump scares probably against a Ghostface than I do any other killer. But if he is as spicy as the rest, yeah. The couple I've had today have been like that. They've either just been like super spicy or just not fun in general. This one I'm not gonna judge, but I don't know yet. I don't know where he is. Frick. I'm kind of over this match now because after that, Michaela ruined the vibe. Mm. 
Survivors will do that for me. Like, if they're just gonna, like, give up on their first hook when nothing's going Ooh. wrong yet, my vibe gets ruined. And then I just don't really feel like playing the match anymore because it's like, well, now we're down 3v1 because somebody doesn't want to play. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Steve needs a new sweater. He does. He does. It's He's been through a lot. He's been through a lot, so. Friday the 13th, lover 12. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on into Skelly Town. You get all your jumps from Mikey. That's the thing. Is like every Mikey I come across never jump scare me. There's been a few here and there, but I never get a good jump scare Mikey. Ghost phase is the one that scares me the most. And then Hag? Every once in a while, if her traps are set very well. But Mikey, every time I play against one, they're just not that that jump scare. And it's kind of sad because I want to have, like, a good match against a jump scare Mikey. Thank you. Oh, thank you. I was going to heal you. <laughs> He is wearing a sweater, I hadn't noticed. Where did this ghost face go? Watch, he'll probably pop around a corner and scare the hell out of me. Well, I guess I'll do this one. I don't know if he can see me here. It's... Oh, well, Meg, now he knows we're here. It's so random. Where the hell did he go? Oh, there he is. I don't know why I'm being so quiet. We were all in the area and he never saw us. Maybe, very well could be. With the way the day is going, there's been a couple times where I've wanted to just like, screw it, I'm over it, I'm done. But then I always think, okay, well, wait, my teammates, my teammates. Because this match is turning around. She's the only one gone. That's okay. It's okay. I let them get me, and then they can run off and hide for a minute. I did it for that gin. I don't know why she did that. <laughs> I would do the same mostly. I've had the thought. Don't get me wrong. I've definitely had the thought of doing that. Wish I had inner healing right now. See if I can hide out here. And he'll run away. And hopefully I can like maybe head on stun him. Doubt it. I don't know why the Rebecca did that. I know why she ran away. I just don't know why she walked up to him and pointed. Oh, well, every she's got quick fingers. Holy crap. I keep trying to heal her first and she's good. 
She gets it first every time. We both on death hook? Yes. Did I finish main? I don't think so. Okay, they're over there. Or he's over there. I don't know if Meg's with him. Meg is a damn good runner. She's either outrun or beat out his exposed status effect twice. Oh, well, this isn't good. I'm going to just get rid of this. match. I mean, we're down to one gen. I am on death hook and so is Rebecca, but oh, and he's right after her. So we could definitely get this done. I don't think we're all going to get out though. Meg be killing it with the runs. So mm, she's dead. I don't want Meg to get out of this match, so I might not try too hard for the door. I wonder if the doors are easy to guard for him. He's definitely doing that, that tactic, kind of going between both doors, checking on it, go to the door, check on it, go to the door, check on it. Looks like they're in a pretty good position for him to keep an eye on both of them. Okay, I'm gonna go for it. If I don't get it, I don't get it. He just left. He's coming for me. He's gonna expose me. Make, and then hopefully she'll get out. Ah! Go for it, Meg! Go for it! I didn't even run so she could get out. They were in a really good position, so... He could easily guard both of them. Her button is stronger to say with cookies. She got a strong button too. Cause damn, I was pushing that button as soon as she got near and she beat me to it every time. She beat me to it every time. Well, GG's nonetheless. I'm glad that that Meg. A GG. Uh, that Meg was a really good either looper or good at losing ghost face. Cause damn, she did it more times than one. Kermitly Frog! <laughs> oh my god, what a cute name! Kermitly Frog! Dying Light Ruin, save the best for last again! And Sloppy Butcher. What did she have? Sprint Burst, Quick and Quiet, Adrenaline, nice, and Kindred. Nice! I think it was probably the combination, maybe a Sprint Burst, Quick and Quiet. 
that kept leading her to get away. Damn! I mean, I got strong butt too sometimes, but... <laughs> All right, I think I'm gonna call it there today though because it is time for dinner and at the same time I'm kind of over all these matches. That last one ended up being good. Why ever Michaela gave up, why ever she left the match, didn't even matter. We ended up getting all the gens done and I'm just glad Meg got out of there because I think she is the reason we got gens done. She was exposed at least twice. I know she outran it. And then I know she got some saves in there and kept him occupied a couple times while me and Rebecca were doing gens, or I think we're probably both doing the same gen, but nonetheless, she kept him busy. He had a good patrol. You could tell by the way um, he was walking back and forth, so he probably had a really good line of sight for both doors. So it was either me or Megan, hopefully, or not hopefully, was glad that she was able to get it. So I have no hard feelings about how that match went. I'm just sad that, you know, it, oops, wrong button. I'm just sad that I couldn't survive my last match. Oh, I was gonna look at something, but oh well, I already pushed exit. But it was definitely a day in the fog, holy hell. I can't tell you how many times where at the end of the match, I'm just like, you don't deserve a GG and you don't even deserve anything. <laughs> you just deserve to go on to your next match and let me go into my next match and forget all about it. All right, let's see who we want to raid today. Kind of want to go raid this person, but let's see how long they've been on. Whoops, bad. This person's been on a really long time, but I want to see if they're going to stay on because I would like to raid over here. Just made though, I have an ad. But anyways, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. I appreciate it. We are going to go right over here. They're currently in a match, but they could be getting off soon. But we're still going to go right over here. All right, let me get the raid going before, before I lose it. But I'm going to look right now. I'm going to look probably as soon as I get off, and then I will go look, Brad. Um, but I don't normally look at my Discord very closely during stream. But I will look at it after now. Well, after I raid out here. But we're going to go raid a scuba not Siva. He is an actually a really fun person to watch. He raided into our channel once, and I appreciated it so much. We did get to play with him in a match once as well, and he was a lot of fun. And we're going to go raid over to his channel, say hi, and I highly recommend. He's a lot of fun to watch. I hang out here quite a bit, just lurking and listening to him and his friends have fun in the fog but i thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today i appreciate it for being a saturday and everything i continue i will continue streaming on saturdays from here on out and i will be back monday but on monday it'll be variety monday with a new name i will think if i want to use the two suggestion ones you guys gave me but we'll be playing the resident evil DLC, I think, on Monday. So if you guys are looking forward to that, that is what we will do. We'll, what we will be doing, tongue twister. But thank you guys for hanging out with me today. Let's go give all the love to Steve, who is also a Steve main. If you guys like some Steve gameplay, highly recommend watching. So again, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. If copy the raid messages, please, if you would like, and I will see you guys on Monday. Bye bye.